morning happy wednesday to me happy wednesday to you mr west happy I west satisfying day. violent poop this morning oh nice nice was it one of those that were just really if you felt the relief after it was out like you know it was kind of you know it was it was really uh, what's the word kind of ruminating in there and just as soon as it was, you were you were good. I had quite a satisfying. Oh, I got the uh, I got the last nugget out. It was well, Mr. West. I'm glad that you're celebrating your 26th month month anniversary month anniversary with a nice violent poo. <laughs> Thank you very much for 26 months, Mr. West. Oh no, I identify with that. Like just. When you can feel a shit brewing and it won't come out, and then finally, no matter how violently it comes out, it does does eventually. Okay, diggity, I'll see you in a bit. You have a wonderful run. Don't fall over, remember, right? 
drunk good morning, dark good morning, karma for Haley, a snello to you, Haley. Zach. <laughs> Zach, how are you doing today? Oh, I always say your name so violently, but it just, just one of those names that just, Zach. I don't know, it just comes out, just, just comes out like that. Hello, Debbie. Would you like a, would you like a treato? Would you like a little bit of a, a treato? Hmm? Take it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you just eat one of my fingers with it as well. Take it. Um, nom, 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 nom. Hello, persecutor, persecutor. What are you reading at the moment? What are you reading? Take it. I haven't read anything since I um since I read City of Ashes. Is that what it was called? City of Bones? I haven't read anything since. Good girl, take it. There's a good girl. Yeah, such a good lady. I've been thinking about getting the second book in the series, but um, I picked up the collector's edition of it. So I feel like I want to pick up the collector's edition of the rest of the series as well, so it looks nice together. Um, but they haven't bought that one out yet. Susie Book. Good girl, take it, yeah! Well done! Do you want to do a catch as well? Ready? Catch! Yay! Good job! Good, Good job! I have been listening to the Hellblade OST <gasps> earlier today, yes! so I am suitably traumatized oh. now. Flushed face. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Thank you. I really, I, I re you know, I don't want to give you too many spoilers for the Game of the Year Awards, the CBT Game of Year Game of the Year Awards, um, as we're dubbing it. Uh, but I, I might that might be like my soundtrack of the year. I don't know if we did soundtrack of the year last year. I was thinking it was going to be Cold of the Lamb. But I'm not sure. But I'm not sure now. It's just, I don't know, it's just got such a good soundtrack to it. Feeling lonely. Oh, I, could, I couldn't be with all you guys here, could I? And with a little doggy. <laughs> I like how she ducks her head down. She's like, I don't want to be touched. I want to be fed. Hmm? That's what you're here, isn't it? You want the snacks? Not the, not the rubs. Fine. I never had enough snacks for now, though. Just walked through a parking lot that was filled with porta potties and trash. Wouldn't recommend. I mean, you wouldn't recommend. Chad, you just walked through my house. <laughs> We've got a great trip advisor rating. I'll have you know. <laughs> snacks, not rubs. <laughs> Good morning. How are you doing? <laughs> and there she is. There she is. She's realised it's not snack. It's not snack time, nor is it rub time. Like a little croissant, a little croissant. Hey, I would not even good morning. I was thinking of the B B Bukowski? Bukowski novels. I I don't know what they are, actually. Yeah, she's a good girl. She'll she'll be up and walking around again and like give her 30 minutes, she'll she'll have had enough. <laughs> Rex, how are you doing this morning? Uh, how how are you enjoying your... Is it this your last week of freedom? I thought maybe next week might have been your last week of freedom. Oops. Ah, it's not as post-war stuff. Ah. Uh, what's he been? Ham on Rye. Oh, I like the I like the name of that book. That sounds like something. That sounds like a good meal. Yeah, I think they seem a little bit the the books seem a little bit sad, for want of a better word. You know, it's something that's gonna really make me feel, and I. <laughs> it's not quite something I want, I guess. Oh, he's died. I I guess he was born in nineteen twenty, so it's not too surprising. There were just so many modern looking pictures of him, so I thought, um... Thought maybe he was still alive. Mmm. Said he didn't need to know, and here I am reading the Wikipedia page, like, hmm. Oh, yeah! Captain Fagetel world premiere tomorrow. I've got my ball gown ready. Yeah, we do have a, um, a premiere, premiere, premiere. 
set on the YouTube channel for the uh, video to go up at, I think it's, I think the premiere starts at 5.15, so the idea was is that we could, could go on over there from stream, but then we might, we might end up, um, we might end up running over with Resident Evil Village. So it's a bit of a test. It's a bit of a tester. But yeah, go follow me on YouTube. So you can watch the world premiere of a Captain Badgertail. Captain Badgertail video. It's my favourite game. Sherlock Holmes vs. Jack the Ripper. Definitely didn't feel emotionally scarred from that whatsoever. Really like the realistic pictures of all the victims that they use. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> We don't have the adorable pighead emote from that game here. No, we do have it in Discord though. We do have it in Discord. I did a... I, so that moment is in the video where I do the... Not to give you spoilers. But that moment is in the video. And I was watching it. And I was like, man. That was really fucked up of me. Because you can see that I'm so like... I'm so concentrated on getting the perfect... I'm like, man, I look like a, like, I look unhinged. <laughs> Reading an excellent book series called The Stormlight Archives. Ooh, I have heard of them. I feel like I've seen it on Bookstagram, which starts with The Way of Kings, and it's really good. It's epic fantasy, and it's really good. Would you say it was really good then, Haley? How long is it, and how many books are in the series? My favorite game that I've never played prior to streaming of it. Oh. Uh, yeah, I know you said, you said prior to streaming it because uh, you didn't want me to say Mass Effect. You didn't want me to cop out and say Mass Effect. Um, favorite game I've ever played... Favorite game I've played... That I never played prior to streaming it. So favorite kind of game I've played on stream as a first playthrough. So I've got a, I've got a couple of, uh, I've got a couple that come to mind. I'm, so it's rare that I go back to a game after I finish streaming it. So I don't know if I've actually got any games that I have gone back to. So I've gone back to Forgotten City. Uh, I did a, did a stream of that when it first came out. Um, it was actually my first key that I ever got given. And I did a stream of it when it first came out. And I really enjoyed it on the stream. But there were certain... Um, I wasn't allowed to play the last part of the game on stream. So I only ended up doing one uh, one stream of it because I wasn't, uh, wasn't sure when I was meant to stop. So... And I didn't kind of want to invest a lot of time on stream and then be like, Right guys, you know, I can't show you the end! So I didn't go back. I didn't end up uh, doing another stream of it. Uh, but I have gone back to it in my own time and enjoyed playing it. So I wouldn't say that's my favorite game, but it's definitely been a good find. Uh, there are a couple of games that come back to me. Pillars of Eternity, Dragon Age, um, Gabriel Knight 2. Not the first one, the second one. Uh, Hitman. Hitman's definitely up there as well. God of War was really impressive as well. Oh, I just, I feel like I haven't got an absolute favorite. There's no like, no standout. Like, wow, this is my favorite game ever, you know? But there are lots of, like, I think I have a hard time picking a favorite game that I've ever played, um, like, in general. But I would say it was probably, like, one of, one of those. I really enjoyed those. I don't think, I don't think I came across that lately. So I'm not sure, I couldn't confirm or, or deny. I don't remember it being in my playthrough. 
Uh, it was a long time ago. I don't remember seeing it, but I wouldn't deny I wouldn't deny that it was in there because I'm not sure. Mmm. I might have just forgotten it. That's what I was thinking as well. I might have either forgotten it, glossed over it, and thought, ooh, you know, like, you know. But I don't I don't remember specifically. I don't remember a moment. That could it could have been like a could have been Baldur's Gate. Um it's in there. Dang. Is it a is it a bit of an extra lore or is it actually in the story? Because I don't remember. I don't remember it being in the main story. Oh good morning, Monty. Good morning. Yeah, it was quite a stamper. Oh vampire. Oh my god. Vampire. Oh, Disco Elysium! I've watched it. I've watched it. Digits! Digits, thank you very much for giving us some to Snaily. <laughs> some to Snaily. Maybe. <laughs> I said to Haley, I wanted to say. <laughs> I wanted to say, like, Snellcom. Like, Snellcom to the s s sweet Sneenies, Haley. <laughs> thank you very much, Digits. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Oh, it's on a gravestone. I don't think I... Re I don't... I mean, I don't, but there's a lot of gravestones that I must have read some of them, but I don't think I remember reading that one. The name's Haley. Snaily. Haley. <gasps> oh, dear. I can never decide between Zelda games which I like the most. I wonder... I think my favourite Zelda game, if I had to pick one... So I've played Ocarina of Time on 3DS. I haven't played it on uh, 64. And it, it was a long time ago, so I don't really remember much of it. Um, I played some of Skyward Sword. I've played nearly all of Wind Waker. And maybe two thirds of Breath of the Wild. And you're going to be like, oh, bad. Why do you never finish the Zelda games you start? It's because I get too invested and I start collecting stuff. And then I get it. I, 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 ruin, it. I ruin it for myself. It's like with the fucking Wind Waker. I started, uh, I wanted all of the statues. I wanted to fill up the statue room. And of course I ruined it for myself because I got to, there is the uh, giant frog god. And you can only get a picture of him at one time in the game. And I had missed that opportunity to get, get a picture of him. So I was like, well, now I have to start the game all over again. Because I'd gotten reasonably far into it. And I was like, oh, dang, I can't be bothered to do that right now. So I put it down and I didn't go back to it because I was like, oh, God, I'm going to have to start again. Why don't I just not get all of the pictures? Oh, like, why don't I get not all get all the statues with all the pictures? Just leave it. I don't need all of them. But no, I do. I do need all of them. So I haven't gone back to Wind Waker. Breath of the Wild, I did the same. I started trying to 100% it. Ruined it for myself. Ruined it for myself and I haven't got back to it. Because I'm like, dang, I've got so much I need to do. No, I don't. I could just, I, I could go and defeat the last, uh, I think I've got one more Divine Beast to defeat and I could go defeat Ganon. But no, no, I'm like, I'm not enjoying it to the fullest. I'm not getting the full amount of dopamine that this game has to offer me. So I have to go around and 100% it. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, I should try Twilight Princess. I do want to do Twilight Princess. I really want to do Majora's Mask as well. I, uh, I've watched some of Majora's Mask, but I'd like to... Ah, Disco Elysium. That reminded me. So I watched Greg play Disco Elysium before it was fully voice acted, and I'm really tempted to go back to it. I'm really tempted to go back to it and um, maybe play it on stream. <laughs> oh, yeah, Chad, I can't wait. I, ca I cannot wait. <laughs> I love that he called me inbred. It's so I love that he did. You are underwhelmed. What do you feel like? It, uh, what what underwhelmed you? Digits. What underwhelmed you? Um, we went to when we were at EGX. Disco Elysium actually had a um like a little stool. Uh, not a stool. Like they had a booth. I think that's what the kids call it. Booth. One dopamine, please. Yes. No, no, but look, fourth, you could either get one dopamine by finishing the game, or you could get 1.5 dopamine by finishing the game with added extras. But you'll also lose two dopamine by doing so. 
You know, it's a real trade-off. It's a real trade-off. <laughs> like two step, uh, one step forward, two step back. <laughs> why do you think I picked a? Why do you think I picked eleventh hour, Chad? I just thought, wow, <laughs> that, <laughs> this game really does just two jobs. We're on the mouse mouse area. Gameplay and internal monologue stuff was interesting and cool. I just felt a little bit underwhelmed by the story. Yeah, I could like yes, like yeah, I could see why you would be. Yeah, I, yeah, I, I guess I could. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right, you guys ready for the? It, I don't even really want to preface what we're doing here. So our girlfriend that who we hate because we said to her that she only got her current job because she slept with me. Uh, she got kidnapped because she obviously got upset that I said that to her so she ran away. She then got kidnapped. And we rode our really manly motorcycle to come and save her. And she's kind of stuck in Stouff's house, which is from the seventh, uh, seventh guess the game before. And now we have to do all these, all these puzzles to find her. And last, uh, last stream, I lost my mind doing this fucking mouse puzzle. Because it is the worst thing in the world. Yet here we are again. Oh, I can't wait for the FFP. I'm very excited. Our character might be a dick. But he does have some good FMB scenes. Oh, see, look, he just wins! Yeah, I decided to play the sequel. I was just like, I. This looks like another case unsolved. I was like, what more of a perfect game could I want for Halloween? I have figured out I think I've figured out how this works so this I think shows the first so if I swap this over if I swore was to swap this line over it will first appear as a shape that 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 shape will appear here and then it will rotate Nope, that's a lie. That's a lie. I still don't understand it. But I'm pretty sure that's the that's the first shape that shows up. I just lied. Looks like I'm still stuck in here. CBT fear. Stop trying to dig out. <laughs> also, <laughs> but if you'd stop trying to dig out with your spoon. I just pre well, that's I think that's still fine. I think it's fine. <laughs> so thank you so much. <laughs> Stop trying to escape. <laughs> We're gonna do do this again. It does kind of look like a chessboard. They really like these um. What is this? A, 
a five by five. I just have five minutes of sunlight. No, because you make a run for it whenever I give you five minutes of sunlight. <laughs> Why you guys aren't allowed it anymore? I thought I could trust you. You'd get five minutes of sunlight. There is no sunlight in England. I'd like to know how low our sunscreen sales were, actually. I hate this puzzle. I hate it. I think I, I, I think I fucked it as well. But the patterns do rotate. You think they do? Oh, Babby. 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 How was I supposed to know that something Babby. wasn't right here, oh, Babby? Babby, I shouldn't have let you go and now you're out of sight. You show me how you want it to be. Tell me, Babby, because I need to know now. <laughs> I just love how creamy she was. Now you're out of sight. Y'all look, thank you. Thank you. I just like how unnecessarily creepy GLaDOS is. Alright, can I have one more? Take it! Nom 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 nom. Do we know who the next companion is for the doctor? Let's go like this. Oh, Gullings! I'm glad I get... I'm glad GLaDOS could make you smile. I hope we can keep the company as well, and I hope, uh, like, I, ho I know, I know you probably don't want me to say I hope you feel better, but I do hope you feel better. Like, I know that sometimes, um, like, absolutely what you don't want to hear, but I hope you do. But I needed that one. Ha! I would like to feel <laughs> that easy. I am wishing you absolutely all the best, but you do feel better. Oh baby, ever so slightly thirsty. She's dehydrated. Right. I wish that I could start mid. Okay, if I'm right, this will create a little circle. It did! Okay, it created a circle. They do rotate. They, they do rotate. Okay, it rotates. That's really good to know. But this should rotate. Your lip, let's kick it. Ice, ice, baby, ice, ice, baby. All right, stop, so collaborate, and listen. Ice is back with a brand new invention. Something grabs a hold of me tightly for like a harp on daily and nightly. <laughs> daily and nightly. That was actually very beautiful, Galados. I feel like she kept quite in tune just then. Galados, the thank you. Ice, ice, baby. Ba na 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 Dun, 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 dun. You're too old to say mid. <laughs> uh, you know, words do have an expir <laughs> expiry date on them. You know. Too old to say something's mid. The kids have got to let us old leapy, elderly people have fun some days. You biplets kick it, ass, ass, baby, ass, ass, baby, all right, stop collaborating, and listen, ass is back with a brand new invention, something grab a hold of me, tightly flow like a harp on daily and nightly. Thank you, Mr. M. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. M. <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh, it didn't quite go how I wanted to do. 
You, but let's kick it ice, ice, baby, ice, ice, baby, all right, stop, pull a break, and listen, ice is back with a brand new invention, something grabs a hold of me tightly, flow like a harp on daily, nightly. Yeah, Morgan Freestyle! <laughs> Thank you, Morgan, for the freestyling. <laughs> I think it should actually go here. Just as, you know. Your... No, I don't think it should go there. Gordon Ramsay once went to Australia and baked a lemon meringue pie on stage. The audience cheered, which Gordon thought was weird, as Australians usually do meringue. Oh my god, boomerang! Boomer, boomerang. Boomerang. I get that. I get, I get that. <laughs> Oh my god, he got it, he win! Try thinking about the solution next time. How did he win? Are you herbal? Still on the mouse puzzle, I don't think I'm ever allowed to leave. I don't think I'm ever allowed to not be on the mouse puzzle. The objective, so Stealth wins if I get the mouse, uh, Stealth wins if he gets the mouse to this and exit. I win if I get the mouse to this exit. And uh, we have to turn these little squares around to create a path for the, for the mouse to kind of get to the exit. And the square, you can only turn the squares from the outside. And it will first start with this and then rotate round. Clockwise, I think. <laughs> went to Australia and they let him leave. Why <laughs> did the mayonnaise win the running race? Because the tomato sauce couldn't, couldn't catch, catch up. up. Couldn't catch up. Couldn't... Couldn't catch up. Couldn't catch up. Thank you. Thank you. Good thing it wasn't an egg and spoon race, you know, because mayonnaise is made out of eggs. Hey, okay, good morning. Good morning. So, this would then turn into that. Oh, Grimmay, thank you very much. Thank you. I was waiting for... <laughs> I was waiting for some sauce related pun. <laughs> Thank you very, very much. Thank you. <laughs> that looks like that. And then it would. That. That looks. I think we do it along the bottom. man walks up to a grieving widow at a funeral and okay. asks if he could I say a few words. Of course, the woman says to which the man replies, Feeling lonely. <laughs> yes. The woman says, I'm going to have to start again. <laughs> These are my favorite, my favorite jokes. Are those fucking... <laughs> Those ones that are like, oh, the man walks into a funeral and talks to a grieving widow. They're just so silly. Good morning, Heil. Good morning. I'm glad you keep you keep you company on the commute. I think if I just keep doing this line, I know you heard that from me yesterday. 
I know you heard. Oh, if I just keep going down this line, I'll, I'll win. But I really think it's gonna work this time, guys. I really think... <laughs> I really think it might do it. I think it's advantageous to be here. Yeah, I was hoping this stream would actually last 11 hours. really annoying that I can't seem to get because if I swap these round it's just gonna fuck up this line I think I'm thinking we do up here I have to get back to work see oh, you tomorrow Dark. for Badger Thursday if yeah! I can make it work Dark, I will see you tomorrow another man Thank comes you. up and asks if he could say a couple words mm -hmm. the widow thanks him saying that would be very nice the man Very clears nice. his throat and says, Being a lot, the widow replaced. Thank you. He would have liked that. What voice was that? What voice was that? He would have liked that. Oh my god, Batch. <laughs> that poor man. <laughs> Who the fuck is Goldbridge? Why does he sound so British? He's just so British. Yeah, he would have really liked that. Yeah, we are streaming tomorrow. On the Thursday. Uh, because I've got a doctor's appointment on Friday. So we're doing Thursday. Be there or be square. You wouldn't want to be square. Nuh-uh. Mm -mm. Not at all. Beep beep. Beep beep. <laughs> beep beep mouse coming through. Beep beep. Thank you very much. I think we go from down here. I don't know if this is right, guys. I don't know. It was this horse chick chick cheering fish and chips, the two. Put it in the book, block. Like that. Wait, God said the King Queen. Yeah. That was amazing. That was amazing. Oh, I liked that. I liked that a lot. That was amazing. Do you hear that, sis? Oh, I like Gullocks. Thank you very much, Daft. You're a bit daft this morning. Hello, Ian. How are you doing? A man dies, and he goes to heaven. Mm. He asks to watch his funeral to see what people say about oh, him, no. and God agrees. Yeah. Is there anything in particular you're hoping they'll say? Mm -hmm. God asks, to which the man replies, Yes, mm. I'm hoping they'll say, Oh my God, he's waking up. <laughs> One move from winning. You'll not okay. find the next one. Good pleasant. job! Yeah! Isn't that exciting? <laughs> yes! Yay! That was a bit of an accidental win, if I'm honest. Because I didn't uh, I didn't calculate that far ahead. Bloke, cal calm down! <laughs> Half awake because my doctor's office called me at 8.30 a.m. Really tricky. Probably drop off, but I wanted to pop in. No, Ian, it's so lovely to see you. Hey, Clone held the door open for me today. What a nice gesture. What a nice gesture. The door open for me to meet Clone. What a nice gesture it is. Held the door and meet him to life. What a dog it doesn't eat. I'll just eat for me to me to eat for me to me to me We live again. None of us were dead by the time she saw this. Your big let's kick it. I say it's Bobby. I say it's Bobby. Right, stop, collaborate. 
and Liston has his back with a brand new invention something grabs a hold of me tightly flow like a half all daily and nightly. Uh, he's not gonna freestyle at the end of that one. <laughs> oh, thank you. Rook, thank you. Fab, thank you. I still. <laughs> oh my god. That would be a Northern English accent. Well done, Badger. You did so well, I'll give you a little hint. You are playing against stuff. Spoiler alert, RK, spoiler! I can't, I can't believe you just revealed that very, very secret part of this game. <laughs> I thought, I thought I was playing, playing against Goldbridge. <laughs> you, Bip, let's kick it, Ice Ice Babby, Ice Ice Babby, all right, stop, collaborate, and list in Ice's back with a brand new invention, something grabs a hold of me tightly, full like a harpoon daily and nightly. Shadow's the hottest hedgehog from Sonic. I, I... I just had to remind us all of that. <laughs> it was so good. <laughs> it was. Oh dear. Yo, Bip, let's kick it, Ice. Oh, ice God. Baby, oh, so baby, all right, stop, neighbor it. <laughs> and listen, Ice is back with a brand new invention. Something grabs a hold of me tightly, throw like a harpoon daily. I always worry. I I always worry when we do a um, we do a David. I always worry that he's not gonna make it to the end. I just. <laughs> you, Bip, let's kick it, Ice Ice Baby, Ice Ice Baby. All right, stop, collaborate, and listen. Ice is back with a brand new invention. Something grabs a hold of me tightly, flow like a harpoon daily and nightly. Thank you very much. Thank you, Arky. Thank you, Galux. Weep always does. Weep always does really well. There a doll room here. Shadow the Hedgehog playthrough when is has Shadow got his own game? Cause I don't want my uh want my Shadow games diluted with other hedgehog other hedgehog friends, you know? I want all of my attention to be on Shadow. He does have his own game. Why haven't we played it yet? He even has a gun <laughs> I, for some reason I didn't think guns existed in the Sonic universe. Constipated Hagrid voice. I don't know. I, I've never done a constipated Hagrid voice in my life. I don't know what you're talking about. Surely I'd remember doing something like that. <sighs> Shadow the Edgehog. Why so hot? I remember playing uh, Mario and Sonic at the Winter Olympics ga Winter Olympic Games, and just he was just always so much cooler than the rest of the uh, than the rest of the crew. Yeah, the game is missing the cutscenes after the solved puzzles, like Seven Geth Guest had. One hundred percent it is. One hundred percent. Oh, did I just sit anywhere, honey? Menus around the table. <laughs> that it? Just sit anywhere, honey. Menus around the table. That's it. Oh, that's my girlfriend. That's, that's the girlfriend that's gone missing. And that was a, that was a hand that wasn't actually a hand. That does sound like Spongebob music. So it was tonic water I needed. Rolling, Rolling ro Rock Bottle Cap. 
I solved one of these puzzles, which was Winter Coat. Um, uh, Winter Coat had a mixer, so Tonic Water was the mixer. I uh, don't quite get why it was a Winter Coat, but I'm not, you know, I'm not, not here to ask questions. I'm just here to solve puzzles, right? Um, and now we need Rolling Rock Bottle Cap. Rolling Rock Bottle Cap. Rolling Rock Bottle Cap. Would be pop? Some, something like a, a bottle bottle cap, a pop, pop, pop. Moss grows thick on a rolling stone. Oh! I'm sorry. Everyone here is dead right now. Oh, I... Please leave a requiem at the tone. I was actually going to call the police. Hey, Barhead, welcome in. Welcome in. Now it's your first time in the stream. I can see it's your first time. Rolling stone. I'm thinking moss grows thick on a rolling stone. Yes, that is the same skeleton hand. It's the same skeleton hand from um, the seventh guest, actually, as well. I was glad they brought it back because I really like the sassy leg. I like how sassy it is. Can I not go in? I hate how I can't go in to some of the... Ooh, bad move. Where am I going? Oh! Interesting. Okay. Um. I wonder if it originates from Seventh Guest or somewhere else. Yeah, I wonder if, uh, I wonder if on, oh, but other websites. <laughs> Like websites took inspiration from seventh guest, or where the seventh guest took inspiration. Oh, ah, the what? What? I was I was doing anything. I just I just had to I had to leave my mouse cursor there for a second. I um. Oh god, it just keeps it just keeps grabbing. I was just just having a bit of my coffee, you know. Hey, but Fluffy, how are you doing? <laughs> I had to put my hand there. I I was just <laughs> Hey Fog! How's your morning going? What's this? Come on. Get rolling. Get rolling. Rolling. Get the ball rolling. Lint roller. Um. Oh, sorry, man. Sorry, that was very. I didn't. I didn't mean. I didn't mean. I didn't mean to. I swear that one wasn't intentional. Um. <laughs> sorry. I just, I just don't know where to, I don't know where to put my fucking cursor. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Can we get <laughs> I'm not pervert! Oh my god! I that was an accident. Can we guess too? So in some way, I like I want to be able to see you guys, your guys' guesses, because I want to know what you're thinking. But at the same time, I don't want to get a, um, I don't want to get too many clues. So yes and no, <laughs> vaguely yes, but vaguely no. I don't want to get the answer. Rolling, like you roll a cigarette. Lost your thinking cap. No. What's that? What's he got? Hmm. Yeah, 
exactly, exactly. Rolling, That's roll paper, rolling paper, paper, roll paper, roll <laughs> paper, roll paper. Hey, Roger. <laughs> yeah, of course you can, Roger. Yeah, I don't want too many clues, but I oh carpet. Work with me here, sport. <laughs> I only like wrong guesses only, I guess. <laughs> it's not I'm meaning. You have the intellect of a banana slug uh, and the same good looks. Mm. A rolling pin. Roll. Roll. A rock and roll. Like an instrument. What do we think about an instrument? Loves anagrams. Rolling rock bottle cap. I can't be an anagram. Can't be. How do I get out of this room? Oh, there we go. Maybe bowling. I don't think Stauf is a Stauf. Stauf isn't cool enough to have a, a bowling alley in his house, unfortunately. Oh, do you ever watch those like Architectural Digest uh, YouTube videos where they're like, "Oh yeah, welcome to my welcome to my cinema room," and it is just like literally a like a like it's a cinema. Angry gamer beer is that what it? <laughs> is that an anagram? <laughs> Isn't an angry gamer beer just like a G Fuel or something? Right, I think I think instrument, like rock and roll. That's what I'm You actually know the answer from a game of guy. Yeah, don't yeah, don't uh, don't tell me if you do know the answer. Lupi Pele Kikitisis Baby If his baby all jade stop collaboratan list and is back with a brand new convention Samin Grabe Road of Nightly Flop like a rapun Daylian Nightly. That's amazing. Galaxy, I think that's gotta be the best one. I think I think that's gotta be the best one. That was amazing. Merci, Gullet, merci. You're a tad slow there, Carl. Well, it's funny, because it's, 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 you remember Tad? Do you reckon this is openable? Probably not. Yeah, I'm just, just drinking my coffee. <laughs> I can see why you'd make a good anchor with all that dead weight between your ears. <laughs> Give them some time to shine. Yeah, they gotta they gotta earn their they gotta earn their keep. No wonder why you aren't listening. You've only got a block between your ears. <laughs> he's so mean! I guess at least he's not calling me inbred anymore. A dog. Rolling. Now, did you have problems with blocks as a child also? <laughs> I took a picture of your brain, but it's not developed yet. Look, my doctor said I had 100% Normal brain function. Cheer up, Carl. You'll find it in the last place you look. A rolling rock is a millstone. Maybe mill something? Like some flour or something? But we can't, we can only get into, there's only two rooms where, it, there are a couple of rooms actually. Take that back. There isn't just two, there isn't just two rooms. Captain Badgertail, you are one of the most dedicated streamers I've seen here. 
Wanted you to know we'll think you're amazing. Just really appreciating you today. Tenarian! Sorry, let me just, let me get away from the, the absolutely howling wind. Thank you so much. Thank you. That's so, so fucking sweet of you. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you for both of the videos and thank you so much for the, thank you so much for your kind words. That's so sweet of you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, you'll thank you. <laughs> thank you very much. Oh. Oh. Okay, thank you very much for gifting us out to Denarian. Denarian? See, you think I'm nice. That's until we spend a night in the dungeon, right? <laughs> then all of a sudden, I'm the lady that doesn't give you enough porridge. Thank you. The okay. Marion, welcome to the weenies. Thank you. And Chad, you big sweetie as well. What is what is going on with you guys? Being, being all nice. Thank you very much. Oh. Gone into you guys. Rolling Rock is a beer here in the US. So it might actually be angry game of beer. I refuse to. I refuse to believe it's angry at game of beer. Fell for that one, didn't you? <laughs> bye bye. They just want extra porridge. <sighs> it is. We only have enough porridge. We only have so much porridge. What is that? You're dead. Wrong. The fuck is that? Now? Captain Badger tell under section 6.9 of the Twitch 2's you are banned for being a pervert. <laughs> hey, I just got called nice a second ago! <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> Look, I was just drinking my coffee, it's not my fault where my, where my cursor goes, is it? Goodness me. You but let's kick it Isis baby Isis baby all right stop collaborate and listen Isis back with a brand new invention something mm -hmm. grabs a hold of me tightly full like a harpoon daily and nightly. Thank you Galax. Who is movie guy meant to be? It kind of sounded a bit like um Oh I guess it's the guy that is like ah oh, this time coming to a cinema near you kind of thing right? Alex, thank you. Featuring Badger and Oliver Tist yelling, More? You want more porridge? Oh! This looks like another case, Unsar. Oh, no. This summer. I thought this might have been the, like, the bottle cap, the ball, you know? The Can't you think stone. for yourself? Nice, fun pervert for anime and furry characters. Not a fairy, <laughs> Just because I think Shadow is objectively the hottest hedgehog. Yo, it doesn't let's mean. Kick it ice, ice, fairy. baby, ice, ice, baby, all right. Stop, collaborate, and list an ice is back with Have a brand new invention. Have you always gone running to mommy hold of me tightly for help? Like a harpoon daily and nightly. <laughs> I like that that one's called Zuma, but it's very, very clearly Morty from Rick and Morty. <laughs> Thank you, Otto. Awesome. Thank you. They're like, yeah, it's just a, it's a Zuma. This looks like a case for Geraldo. Who? Who the f who's that? Rolling Rock bottle cap. Okay, I'm gonna get it's a- It's a Rolling Rock bottle cap. It's, what do you mean it's a Rolling Rock bottle cap? Is it a, is it actually a- Is this, is this an anagram? <laughs> I need a furry Friday for Badger to play through the Shadow Saga. Wait, you're telling me there's more than one game? It's a whole, it's a whole saga. <laughs> a bottle cap from a beer, that's what I was thinking. Maybe it is an anagram though. Are there any slide puzzles? What, like... Like, like, slide puzzles. 
know if there are any slide puzzles. I don't know. You have to you have to find out on this exciting episode of Eleventh Hour whether there will be any slide puzzles. I don't know. I can't confirm nor deny if there are any slides in this game. Is this actually a reference to something? What is this? I might actually need a little bit of a... I might need a little bit of help if this is a reference. Next him. Rolling might mean turmoil. Oh! Is something about Geraldo? Ah, uh, you know, a gentleman never leaves a puzzle unsolved, so any kind of puzzle, any kind of puzzle is exciting. Could be a rolling cap made look like a rock, that's what I thought. So I was thinking like a circular bottle cap. Might mean turmoil. Do we want to like, <laughs> do we want to find Stout's diary or something? Not trying to be helpful to you, otherwise. <laughs> I need to find Geraldo. Maybe, like a picture of Geraldo. Who? What does fucking Geraldo look like? What is this? Turmoil. What feels particularly tumultuous? Not, not a bottle. Turmoil. I think that deserved a room. I think this terrible, terrible puzzle. Oh my god. I have a dead plant with more intuition. That's amazing. What's this one? Seventh guest again. Big box seventh guest again. I can't open any of these. How do you. Pr oh dear. No, I don't. I don't. Well, how do you say Geraldo? Geraldo! Hey, Woody, I just got back from Taco Bell. Geraldo! 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 I do, Galax, I do. I used to have Sesame Street. <laughs> Sesame Street Big Box. Now you're saying Geraldo. Correct, correct. Turmoil. Organs are particularly tumultuous, right? The Bible? Geraldo! Geraldo? I'm sure it's Geraldo. Is that not how you're supposed to pronounce? Is that not how British people pronounce? Is it Haroldo? No, it can't be Haroldo. Is it Haroldo? Like What's the matter, Carl? Can't function without your cue cards? Uh, yeah, Carl is some kind of, um... Geraldo. Gerald. Do. Geraldo. Maybe, is this a picture of Geraldo? Is a frontal lobotomy required for this activity? You can't touch this, my, 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 you can't touch this music, hits me so hard, makes me say oh. My lord, thank you makes for blessing me, me with a mind to roam, too hyped, feed it feels good when you know you're down a super dope homeboy from the Octone. Makes me say oh. <laughs> you know it. Thank you. Makes me say oh. Rock a must rock? be another anagram. Cock? No. <laughs> cork! Cork. 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 Right. <laughs> I was only a little bit off. <laughs> Will 
she her say? Cock. Oh, she did. Glados, please. I thought she. Glados, have some fucking decorum. Jesus Christ. Have some decorum. She thought about it for a bit, at least. She didn't just immediately. Gladys has no shame. <laughs> right. <laughs> have games have been choose puzzles with no clues about how they work? Yeah, it's like like a little bit of oh piss, we've just got back exactly where we came from. Yeah, she looked at the page, thought, do I have to say this? And I thought, yeah. Yeah. I wanna get my porridge. Yeah, maybe a champagne cork. I don't think I've seen any bottles of champagne around. I can't remember. Is that the door? I don't want to just go straight through it again. I look lost. No, do are you feeling lonely? I keep your peepers peeled for some champagne corks. Hey, good morning, JD. Chicka chee. Chicka chee. Agent, thank you very much for that follow. Chee. Welcome in. By the way. Kane, how is your Tuesday get Wednesday going? Right. We're looking for champagne. So that's not champagne, that's tonic water. That's a lot of seventh guest boxes. That's not champagne. There is a kitchen, but we can't currently get in the kitchen. So we can see here the places that we can get to. We can get to the gallery, the lab. The foyer, the library, the uh, Brian Dutton's bedroom. We could try the gallery again. Gallery sounds like somewhere you might end up drinking champagne. I thought that maybe you'd have a bevy. Maybe. Ready to snarl, Carl? I thought maybe it was openable. You know, some people keep their alcohol in um in a globe. I don't think we can get around- I don't think we can get the cupboards open. i go to the gallery again, if I can. I, um... Oh, too deep. I think, uh, I think it's because it, it sounds a lot like something else, and, um... I'm pretty sure it was a long time ago. I think the TTS, the, t the TTS artisans um, were being a little bit mis misused for it. I think it ended up having to be a. Uh, it should have been temporarily banned. But I guess I forgot to unban it. Why did you want to say it, Tutti? Why did you want to say it? Obama. Greetings, Captain Badgertail. This is ex President Barack Obama. I really appreciate what you do for your streamers and your country. I'm looking forward to seeing more of you in the future. Keep it up. Hover. <laughs> I always knew GLaDOS! I knew GLaDOS 
was in charge of America. I knew it. <laughs> I knew Gladys was behind it all. <laughs> Thank you, Tuesday. Thank you. So I don't have Barack Obama turned on. Um, for uh, because we we you know we stay away from politics. So I don't have Barack Obama or on uh, other political political um uh, figures turned on. But if you exclamation mark EDS. Um, it will <laughs> something something turning on above. <laughs> yeah, you'd be able to see the you'd be able to see the list of be able to see the list of them. But if I've turned any on or turned any off. <laughs> oh, I think they've got alcohol in their hand. You see that? Just there. Ha! As if it would be that easy. Better leave it alone. I'd say you're in enough hot water. I just, I just have to check, all right? Just checking. <gasps> no. One of the answers is going to be sunflower, isn't it? You can't touch this, my mama, mama. You can't touch this mush. It gets me sore. It makes me say, oh, my lord, thank you for blessing me with a mind to rum and to hop feet. It feels good when you know you're not a suicidal kisser. Sorry, what? You're such a loser, Carl. God, he's so mean. Where is this champagne bottle meant to be? And is there no puzzle here either? Usually there's a puzzle per room, but I don't see any puzzles. from your run Kate diggity how was it can we have a run run down my roaming hands honestly that's part of me that thinks it would be so funny if we had an eye tracker on me but equally I don't kind of want to be exposed like that Oh, it's a nice, cool autumn. Very lovely, actually. I suppose autumn's much more night, like much more pleasant to run in, like than the the heat of the sun, the heat of the summer. I got, I, I did try and uh, open this, but it doesn't. You're Unless I have dead to like wrong. grab it in a particular fashion. I can see why you'd make a good anchor. With all that dead weight between your ears. <laughs> Did my heart meet to go up when the skelly hand went over the ass? It's probably because I got nervous because I knew I was doing something. Oh! Yeah, we were thinking like a champagne cork. Oh. We're back here. Good. Um, yes, maybe we've. Ah, your mother wore combat boots. What? Did you just say about my mom? You're grasping at straws. So, tonic water's on the fireplace. Couldn't solve it. Oh, my. Oh my! Oh my!
Where did I even come in? Reality. What a concept. Hey, Carl! Was an old timey insult mostly in the 1940s. When is this game Good set? Good night. Don't let the bed bugs bite. <laughs> Maybe we'll go back to the tonic bottle. Imagine if it's just. Uberty, uh, uberty, oh. uberty, uberty, uberty. Uh, that's all, Carl. How many voice lines did they record for me getting it wrong? Oh, money. Keep at it, Carl. How Even much money? Is that five hundred dollars? Do you have five hundred dollar notes in America? Oh, take that! Take that money with you. I was thinking maybe it could have been in the chapel because you know, you have you have wine. So is it, uh, is it an old note? Oh, maybe over here? Oh, I didn't mean to go through that. We're just going to go back to exactly where we came from. I don't think we want that money. <laughs> I think we'll leave that money where it is. I'm gonna have a peepo around. Not enough creepy dolls in these walls. Have I showed you the map? what that room's called? Do you see it's called the doll room? The, the doll room. <laughs> oh wait, I remember the doll room from the from seventh guest. I hated that. You see the doll at the end of the hallway as well. I hate that. Do they have more collector's value than the value of the note? Or has it, like, uh, has the value kind of diminished? Yeah, you see there's a bottle over here. Can't you think for yourself? But we've, yeah, we've already, we've already done the tonic water. So I doubted that we would be the cap as well. At least. Make an educated guess. Of course, rock is an anagram of cork. We knew that! We knew that. Register. 
No, I've just been there. I didn't see a single cork. There's one of the... Okay. I do not enjoy these sounds. What do you mean, Mr. West? This is like ASMR. God, this is like a, uh, like at school where they would do like an orienteering class for you. And they'd hide things in the most absurd places and give you the most absurd clues. Is it bedroom? Okay, we're in the room. That's a light bulb. What's the matter, Carl? We'll, we'll grab it Can't just in case. Without your cue hey, Gabby! Gabby, we're looking for a cork. If you spot one. Oh my god, another new. What is it with all the nude ladies in this game? Fucking hell. A cork. C O R K. Oh my god. I'm researching a story in the staff mansion. You're the only person who survived an encounter with the mansion. Who told you that? Everyone else has either disappeared or died. It's all just stories. Can I like... sit anywhere, honey? Menus around the table. <laughs> oh, she is the doll. Oh my God, that lady is a doll. She's got the doll, because you know all the kids were trapped in dolls, right? I think the blonde lady is a doll, or was a doll. Right? Artsy, excited, lecher. Oh, that's got to be one of the nude ladies. That's got to be, that's got to be a nude lady. That's, that's, that's got to be a nude lady. Hmm, I thought you writers were quick on your feet. That's gotta be, that's gotta be it. One of the nude ladies. Yeah, it could be a prosthetic arm. I just feel like the way they had her grab it. I did, I did think at first maybe it was a prosthetic arm. But I, I just thought the way she grabbed it kind of made it, oh, made it look a little bit more than that. And it almost felt like they were making a bit of a point of it. Click yourself back. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what? Where am I? <laughs> right, we'll go down to the room with all the nude ladies. Good morning, Roku. Roku, we were talking about you yesterday. We were talking about how you enjoyed eating poop in Call of the Lamb. There was a, um... Bad move. There was a, uh, thriller movie that my I remember my one watching when I was um <laughs> I think it was a movie when I was younger it was the this guy with the prosthetic arm that killed that guy's wife but everybody thought that it was the husband that did it but it was actually the guy with the prosthetic arm does anyone know the um know the movie I'm talking about it couldn't be referring to you now, could it? Was I Artsy Excited Lecture? Surely. Huh? I it was that guy! Hello, Marie. I remember it giving Where's me nightmares. Chuck? I oh, thought maybe, maybe you were here to see me. Yeah, I think you guys are right. 
You wish. Is he in his office? He's got a meeting in five minutes. He hasn't got time for you today, Marie. Just tell me why. Yeah, it was the Sater. Sater? Sater. Nice. A right, heart, heart attack. attack could put you into the ground. Ground. There is a heart that maybe it is. Um, I haven't seen like a gravestone or anything though. Has any of, any of the rooms opened up? I just wanna, I just wanna have the map. Thank you. Uh, none of the, none of the rooms have opened up. Eh, of course you did, Rooks. Of course you did. As soon as you heard Artsy Letcher, you were like, I know who that. Is. Yeah, I remember, uh, I remember getting horrific nightmares. I don't remember which painting it was. From, um, watching The Fugitive. Go down to the heart, which is... This way. There was an episode of Limitless where the guy with a prosthetic arm killed his wife and hacked into a bunch of other people's prosthetics. Oh! I like how, like, oh wow, that's cool. I mean, it, it's horrific, but... Make it look like his prosthetic killed his wife against his will. Did they eventually catch him? Harrison Ford in it. I don't know whether the one I watched did have Harrison Ford in. Maybe I watched the TV series because I tried to. Uh, so my mom would watch these, uh, would watch these like thriller shows while she was doing the ironing, and sometimes I would sit with her. I don't typically like those kind of shows because they give me nightmares. Which evidently The Fugitive did give me nightmares because I still think the about it. The bloodless type, are you? Mm -hmm. Attack the word heart. Attack the word heart. They did catch him, because the, the, the protagonist was really good at catching criminals on account of being the limitless drug. Oh! I think that, yeah, Earth. Earth, you're right. Oh, <gasps> so it's the globe! It's the globe, it's the globe, it's the globe. It's the globe. It's the globe. We gotta go, 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 go! I wish it was a little bit clearer which clues were anagrams, but then I guess it might make it too easy. Chica chi. Chica chi. Necro! Necro, Chica thank you very much for the follow! Chica. Welcome in! Happy Wednesday! Thank you very much for the follow. I would have searched for a flower. <laughs> I mean, you could still be right. Watch me click on the earth and stab go. Were well, your mother and father, brother and sister? Mm, I get such a shot of dopamine out of it, Chad. When I get, when I finally, when a puzzle finally clicks, I say that literally. Watch it not have clicked. Yeah! Okay, where are we going? Oh my. God. We just looking at this lady's ankles. Yeah, it's blood. <laughs> oh, <it's bad. laughs> we spent. We just bought. We were looking. 
looking at this poor lady's ankles and then, yeah, it's blood. Yeah, it's blood. It's blood. Yeah. Yeah, with this jaunty music. Yeah, it's blood. <laughs> that's that's the, uh, the that's the ankle anthem. That's <laughs> whenever you're looking at ankles, that music plays. I guess we can save. Battleground. We did. See, we've seen a couple of maces, but like maybe we're thinking about battleground, like something on the ground. It's the sudden cut. Yeah, it's blood. This is what the nineties were like. Just jump cuts everywhere. Battleground. I wonder if actually if anything else has opened up. Yeah, still nothing's opened up. Right. I'm pretty sure I've seen some weapons somewhere. Yeah, it's blood. <laughs> like how Zaxi. Yeah! Yeah, it's blood! <laughs> Star Wars Battleground. Is that any good? Do people still play Star Wars Battleground? Or is it Battlefront? Battleground. Modern Warfare Battleground. We went the wrong way. Rex, maybe I should uh maybe I should clip that sound effect so I can play it during my colonoscopy. Battle Strike Modern Initiative. It's like Age of Empires, but still. Oh, it's actually I do have a question. I've got a question for the floor. Has anyone played any Victoria 3? Yeah, a new Paradox game that's just come out. Oh, no, 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 no. Battleground? Like, maybe there's a rug? I've seen Victoria 3 ads on Steam a bunch. Yeah, I've, um, I've seen the ads and I've been looking at the reviews and it's kind of got a little... It's got mostly positive reviews, but... Kind of uh, the reviews that I've read from people who seem to really, really love Paradox games feel like, uh, feel a little bit mixed. Spend too much on Solaris to give Paradox any more fun. <laughs> Paradox be like, okay, here's the base game. Now here's 20, <laughs> 20 DLC packs you need to buy. With the amount of poop and a wiping in that household, I wouldn't be surprised in this plot. <laughs> Don't need to start Stellaris. I didn't like Stellaris as much as I liked uh, EU or Crusader Kings. I found it was a bit empty. Obviously, it's space, so that's, you know, it is a bit empty, but. I don't know. It didn't. It didn't. It didn't grab me as much. Not a big fan of that genre of simulation strategy anyway, so it's been a bit of a brief interest for me. Oh, 
You and me. No. Mano I a thought... mano. Hey, Carl. You can't touch this. My, 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 my. You can't touch this. Music hits me so hard makes me say, oh, my lord, thank you for blessing me with a mind to rhyme and two hyped feet. It feels good when you know you're down a super dope homeboy from the Oak Town. Amy's, uh, Amy's pleased to have a moment to shine. Amy's, uh, Amy's like, it's my turn for my solo. <laughs> Thank you, Gullix. Thank you. Thank you for letting Amy have her time. Hey, Kenzo. Kenzo, we're looking for a, a battleground. What's a battleground, you may ask? I don't know. I, I don't I don't know quite what the game wants from me, but it, we, we are looking for a battleground. You're such a grind. Yeah, I was thinking that chessboard is like a like a battleground. Love is a battlefield. We are young. Oh. When did uh, when is that game presentation you did go up on YouTube? Oh yeah, it's uh, tomorrow after stream. So tomorrow, five fifteen, I think it goes up. The game uh, for the premiere, the premiere of our next YouTube video. So as long as we don't go over on uh, Resident Evil, Ooh, we can head over there after move. stream. Love to watch a pro gamer like Badge and play Victoria Three before I try it. <laughs> Do you email that to Paradox, please? <laughs> okay. I'd love to see the CBT playing Victoria 3, so you should definitely send her the game and all the DLCs. Need something for your uh, I was aching head? Battleground like a rug. Thank you very much, Kezo. Thank you. Yeah, I got the um I got the swordfish and then the the um, Spike and Fade pair. My my Cowboy Bebop shelf is the the one that I'm proud of, the one that I'm pleased with at the moment. Everything else is just kind of a bit kind of eclectic. Just put it on a shelf. <laughs> just put it on a shelf and hopefully they go together. Oh, I need it. I uh it was one of the so I saw them maybe a, two years ago or so. And I was like, dang. Oh, I really like those. I really want them. And then I saw how much they were going for on the aftermarket. And I was like, oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> never mind. But luckily they got a re-release. That was the uh that was the one positive that's come from the Cowboy Boobob live action. I think I just got a re-release and I snapped them up. Yeah, chuck it all around and let God sort it out. God's a funny name for Greg, isn't it? It's a, it's a bit of a misspelling, Rooks. I know it starts with the same letter. <laughs> These soundtracks rule. Oh, what was the um the ending song? X Men's are two seventh guest. That was pretty good. All my stuff and statues are in storage at the moment. We're trying to sell the house and move everything is away. Hopefully have my nerd cave. Oh, yes! Oh, moving is one thing I'm not... Like, moving with... Like, I'm gonna have to box these back. Oh, no. Oh, it's Mr. Death! Yeah, it was the Mr. Death song. No, that was the beginning of this one. Maybe it was the game. Maybe you're right, yeah. The Mr. Death song was the opening soundtrack for this one. Gonna battle, battle and ground are two words. Wow, are they? I had no idea. Wow. <laughs> Maybe a hoe or a plow. Oh yeah. I don't think I've seen any hoes or plows. I'm like, internally, I'm like, don't make it your mum joke. Don't say, oh, I haven't seen your mum in the house. I'm not going to make that joke, because that would be... I'd be crude. Not the ground we walk on.
not the ground we walk on. Yeah, like a, like a coffee grinder or something. That doesn't anyway. No, I, well, I, I, I didn't make it. Yeah, like a mortar and pestle. But then how is that a battle? Like, I, maybe there's like a battle axe inside the mortar or pestle? Chica chi. Chica chi. Empty brain! Chica oh, that's how I feel. Chica I guess it's M empty, a M empty bran, bran But I definitely feel, I feel like empty brain. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Here we see that love is a battlefield, or more technically speaking, a battleground. In fact, battle and ground. Two different words. <laughs> Thank you, Dave. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I reckon David would have solved this puzzle already. David would have had this done and fucking dusted. Is a frontal lobotomy required for this? I don't know activity? why I thought maybe it would be this. Is not a Twitch user. I can't believe it. I can't believe that no one's played Eleventh Hour and then decided to <laughs> decided to name themselves on Twitch after that exact puzzle. I can't believe it. <laughs> I'm immune to your mom jokes, knock yourself out. <laughs> if I say that, they'll never end. Da 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 da. Oh, has fresh, fresh, uh, fresh finished eleventh guest. I think I realised. I want to know how hard he found it. I know we spoke about it a bit when I uh, when I raided him. I don't think he said that. He, I don't think he'd mentioned that he played it. Keeping things from me. Ooh. I wonder how he found a thirteenth doll then done the whole playthrough. You might recall I suggest you go to him for help if you had trouble right Yeah, I do remember now! I do remember! I do remember. Oh! Okay, that's not what I do. It's all, it's all coming back to me. See, the so I've got some... <laughs> I obviously have a really bad memory. It has its positives and it has its negatives. The positives are that I can replay a game and not remember any of it. So I kind of get a first, I you know, I can get as many first playthroughs as I kind of want. But also the bad things are, <laughs> sometimes things get said to me and just, they just like dribble out of my ear. <laughs> Sex, good morning. Maybe he repressed the traumatic experience that is the 11th hour. I still maintain that I did genuinely enjoy that chess puzzle. Even after the stream, I was saying to Greg, I was like, man, that was a great puzzle, wasn't it? Is that a... Not the same as on TV, eh, Carl? Hey, Carl! I wish I had your brain. <laughs> It definitely is nice getting to replay stuff. Like uh, the Mass Effect series. I have already played it, really loved it. But I still forgot. I still forgot so much of it that I was surprised. And I got to enjoy the story. I love both Mass Effect games. Not the third one, Haley? Not into the, not into the third one? Where am I? Unfortunately, the Magic 8 Ball will probably only be able to give you a yes or a no. Where is static? It is certain that you are static. It is, it is certain. 
that you are indeed you you are no problem no no problem how many puzzles have i missed one two two or one i think we've done the um we did the did the rat puzzle which was kind of kind of okay kind of okay it didn't take us too long It didn't take us too, too long after starting. But we've been mostly doing word teasers. Could ground be the past tense of grind? Right. Battle is an anagram. Oh. Table? No. Tablet. Le bat. <laughs> Bonjour! <laughs> I would like a le bat grind. Table grind. Nah, it needs two T's, but not quite, uh, not quite table. So tablet grind. Grind tablet. So that would be in the lab, right? That we are grinding a tablet. I don't even feel bad for having the hints, actually. I don't even feel bad. Because still, even with the hints, I have no fucking clue what the- like, you know, it's great them telling me that it's a, uh, that it's an anagram. It still doesn't- <laughs> It's- it... <laughs> Shouldn't feel bad, the riddles are awful. It still doesn't- <laughs> Kind of tell me everything. Near that green bottle is there a tablet? Is it that white thing in front of it? What the fuck was that white thing? Is it... Is it like a, a grinder like like one of those small ones? That was a pit... That was massive! That was like that big! They can't just have it be... They can't have it be a tablet. My argument... They, they made grind a very large part of that like puzzle. They were like grind... Grind was the centerpiece of that puzzle. And then all they gave us was a tablet. That had that had nothing to do with grind. That was association, if anything. Right? It wasn't a ground tablet. It wasn't a mortar and pestle. It wasn't something you would use to grind a tablet. That's just something you can put in a grinder. Do you know what else you can put in a grinder? Salt. Anything. You know, you can put whatever you like in a grinder. As long as it consents. Oh my god, what is this? What is what is what am I looking at now? There's a face on a rock. Oh yeah, they've got a big uh, in the library, I think, Seth. They've got a whole row of seventh guest big boxes. I liked that. You've got a lot of fun ahead. It's not funny. It's not funny? <laughs> Why is that man? Why is that man stuck on a rock? Can I watch it from the beginning? Just sit anywhere, honey. Menu's around the table. <laughs> I love the SpongeBob music. Oh no, they won't show it me. You've already finished all the chapters word puzzles. Man rock. Bars deter. Cuckoo bird. Okay. There are, I've seen the clock. I've seen the cuckoo clock. I've seen the clock. The cuckoo clock. I've seen it. I don't exactly remember where, but I have indeed seen a cuckoo clock. And I'm going to be so mad. I'm going to be so mad when it's not cuckoo clock. So... They've said bars deter, so I'm actually going to go for the grandfather clock first. Because the bran- the, the bran? The grandfather clock has bars on it. Is it a good scene? Like, it better be worth all this. It better be worth it. Hey, tomorrow, moo. Good morning. We're on the lookout for a cuckoo clock. See, 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 there, there, there. 
You don't have to be crazy to play here, but it helps. No? Was Robin Morales your bird, Carl? Carl! I hate how he says my name so much. It's not. Cuckoo. Bars. No? Right, we'll try the grandfather clock as well. Bars deter a cuckoo clock. Also, we probably want to check the map to see whether any new any new rooms have opened up to us. Narrator, having to eat to clock is so time consuming. <laughs> thank you very much, Anna. Thank you. We could also try the rooms to see if we can get in as well. Especially if you go for seconds. <laughs> Thank you. Are you guys? Are you guys? <laughs> are you guys double teaming these jokes now? <laughs> Thank you very much, both of you. Thank you. <laughs> you get a new room at the start of a chapter. Oh, they don't give you a. N That's mean. I set them up, then sec knocked them out of the park. Oh, the music's fucking. Cuckoo is crazy, something that's determined, mentally unstable. I was wondering if it was going to be like bars on the window, so I guess that might be, might link to that. Give up yet? Uh, I was thinking maybe bars on the door. Mm, yeah, no, at least there's no, that woman that would show up in the corridor and be like, I hate it. I, you know, I don't want to be mean to her, she's just doing her job, but she jump scared me. Oh, I went the wrong way, but I guess we can have a little peep around here. I will get the next clue if it's not the clock. I will get the get the next clue for it. Terrified of her until like 14 years old. She's scared me. She just appears out of nowhere. She's like, Woo! <laughs> Come down this corridor! It's too bad that you can't increase your brightness, Carl. Maybe the cuckoo is not the bird. Is there... okay, is there a prison somewhere? I've got a feeling there might be like a cage. Or maybe someone's caged in one of the pictures. Right, let's check out one of the pictures first. In the gallery. And then we'll check in the lab. Ooh, bad what? move. Yeah, we'll check to see if there's any... Oh my god. Yeah, there was a dungeon behind the maze. That's what I was thinking. And I think there might have been, I think there might be some straps on the, on the bed. Perhaps to keep someone strapped to the bed. I can't wait until Sunflower is the answer to one of the puzzles. I can't I'm ready for that one. Yeah, I was wondering if it would be the staff painting, because remember he, uh, it was like his ego. There's some birds. 
しれんね。Picture of the composer is so out of place cracks me up that they just took it in. <laughs> oh, didn't they say this game infamously go over budget as well? They probably ran i n g out of budget. They were like, oh, just put this in there. He's just the cowboy that moved in after Stauff. Oh, you know, as, as you do, just, you know, just the cowboy that moved in afterwards. If at first you don't succeed, it's only attempted murder. Tutti, thank you. Uh, 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 let me know when you have a clue. Oh, I thought maybe it was the. Oh, no. So I can't get to the. Good morning, Static. Ooh. You're a tad slow there, Carl. Carl? See, there are some bars here. We can't get to the dungeons. <gasps> bars as in musical bars? What do you think? Like, um. Maybe not. Cuckoo means crazy. Thank you, game. Wow. Yeah, there is a piano. Bars d e t e r is a crazy version of Red Breast. What is that? What's a. Oh, is t a, a robin? Sounds like a bird. They, do they mean a, like a red coat? Like, you know, maybe the money? Groovy try, but wrong. Okay. Oops. Yeah, I feel like it's. Not even just giving me an anagram, it's like it gives me a clue to find the anagram that then makes me find the word, if that makes sense. Like it's a. It's, it's an anagram inside a cryptic cl clue that I then have to. That, yeah, there were those,、um, those birds in the foyer. Bars de t e r is an anagram of red breasts. How would I like. I just. <laughs> I know people said this was a. This was gonna be a, a. The puzzles in this game were silly. But I was like, oh, they can't be that silly. I've played a lot of silly puzzle games before. Some of them aren't anagrams. I just wish it would indicate which one is an anagram because I feel like I. I get what I think it is. We're like, okay. Bars deter a cuckoo. So, we're looking for something that this game thinks would hold a, a crazy person in. So, I'm going around looking for like a, a cell or. Go over there. But it actually turns out that it's an anagram. I haven't gotten to the bad ones yet. No, no, this is as bad as it gets. I think I've got to. Over there and turn. Eleventh hour is the anagram game. I like anagrams. This one? Think, Carl. Think. This one? It's hard to tell you apart from a zombie. You're going so slow. This one? Are you trying to. 
think. I or am. Have a movement. My brain is going. I feel like there's somewhere there's a developer maniacally cacking, cack, cack, cacking, cackling about this. I think the bottom bird, because it does look a bit like a robin. Sorry, I'm just getting rid of some of the brain sweat on my head. Cackling about this. Because they not only put ridiculous puzzles in, but they also, when the player didn't get them right, they insulted them. Yeah, he does have quite a nice wide range of insults. Oh, get out of here. That's the least red bird on the... Fine. Fine. Oh, God, help me. She looks a bit sad, Please doesn't she? Help me. Oh, look, it's me, Carl. Oh, yeah, I had a really satisfying poop today, Stephen, actually. I got all the um, nugs out. How was yours? Oh, a snake. Get out! <laughs> Carl. It's proceeds Look to out. shout at Nintendo DS. Dropped like a ton of bricks. Damn. Damn. Five kilograms lighter. <laughs> Scooch up one step. Uh, I think it was a snake. That is not how you hold a mouse. Who holds a mouse like that? Oh, let me just use my- let me just use my mouse. I- I don't use this finger. I just only use this one. And I reach across whenever I need to click. Yeah, it was just a short one today, you know, I just- Oh? What is that? What? 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 Modern art flourishes under the sun. I know what the- I know- I think I- I know the answer to that one. Uh, I would actually like to see. Um. Chapter 2? She's a real hacker. Oh, maybe we've got some new areas on the map that have opened up, actually. Nope. No, we don't. Never mind. <laughs> Uba, Viva, da. -da. I think that's the right place. It's the only place that I can think that we've seen modern art. Unless modern art is an anagram of something. Modern art is actually an anagram of my mum's fart. The answer was toilet. See sunflower? Modern art? Oh, it's a puzzle. Is it a puzzle? It's a puzzle. It's a puzzle. Oh, how? It... What? What is? I took a picture of your brain, but it's not developed yet. What is this puzzle? There's no F in modern art. Where is how I spell it? Hello? Is anybody home in there? No! Nobody's home! Ha! As if it would be that easy. What is the what's what's the aim of this puzzle? Has anyone got any anyone got any idea? Like I'll take Try thinking about the solution next time. I don't know what the solution is.
How fast can Daniel run? 60 miles an hour, Stephen. 60 miles an hour. Match the colours. I took a picture what of them. What am I matching them to, then? What am I matching them to? It's not developed yet. This looks like another case unsolved. As if it would be that easy. Is mortared like a mortar in a uh, like a medieval mortar that you use? It's graying out a bunch based on what you first click on. Yeah, I just don't know why. <laughs> Have the intellect of a banana slug uh, and the same good looks. I like how they just gave they just gave me this puzzle. They were like, "Oh, do, do you think she needs any any explanation about what she's supposed to be doing here?" Nah. Oh <gasps> no! Are they gullicks? So they just announced that now. Oh. They did. Did they show any of it? They shown a trailer. Oh, I can't. Me being like, oh, they, you know, a lot of these games that are being remade don't need to be remade. I guess Witcher one is a little bit ugly now. It definitely needs a like. It definitely uh, kind of. It's a better candidate for a remake or a remaster than say The Last of Us was. The Last of Us still looks amazing. Which one doesn't? Ah, oh, well, I guess CD Projekt Red is getting more of my money. <sighs> is it getting more of my money? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't feel like we're Couldn't gonna. You know what? Solve it. Oh Let's... my. Let's, um, let's do this in a clever way. One by one, let's see what gets grayed out. Oops, Daisy. Keep at it, Carl. Even a blind pig finds a truffle occasionally. <laughs> Don't think I'll play it, to be honest, until I get eager thighs information. Oh, what if they, what if it features heavily? Looks. What if it features heavily in the um, in the trailer? Windmills everywhere. Eager thighs everywhere. <gasps> oh my god! There'll be dice poker! Oh fuck, what if they remove the dice poker for Gwen? I'll be so sad. I'll be so sad. I buy I you know, I pay my money for the game, I'm ready for some dice poker, and they're like, Oh, are you interested in playing a game of Gwent? I am never interested in playing a game of Gwent. As if it would be that easy. It really doesn't feel like there's a particular rhyme or reason with what's getting, um... Okay. Allow me to... No, never mind. I was gonna say suggest that maybe it's everything the thing you click touches plus two. So this one changes color and then it changes the color of this one next to it. So it seems like the one oh I get it! I get it! Okay, I've all of a sudden I've it's I've got it. 
Right, the one next to it changes to its correct color. So what you want to do is you want to change, we want to be changing all of these guys to their correct colors. So if I click, for example, never mind. I've seen bird droppings smarter than you. Never, it didn't. <laughs> I was like, if so, for example, if I click this one, it would change the color. It didn't. It didn't. Did not do what I thought it would. Even the walkthrough makes no sense of this puzzle. All right. A uh, dice poker is in the Witcher one. You can you gamble. You you gamble and basically you've got to roll your dice. And oh, I can't remember how it works. I think you've got to get a winning hand of dice. So you roll five dice and you can choose whether you re-roll the dice. And your hand has to be better than your opponent's hand. So. Uh, doubles are good, triples are good. Uh, obviously, the best uh, the best hand is getting all five of them. I think it's Witcher One it was dice poker. Was it Witcher Two? Eight hour, nine. Go through the clock in the art gallery again, turn around and look at the modern art on the floor for another game. This game you must choose the last piece of the painting for the best chance. Start with the blue L-shaped piece near the middle. But there is a dice game in Witcher 2. Oh dang, is there not a dice game in... You must select the last piece in the puzzle. Oh, so maybe I have to leave it so there is one piece left. I took a picture uh, of your brain. Okay, I get, I get that. I get what this puzzle is. It's not is. developed yet. I've got to click on the last piece. It can't autofill for me. Keep at it, Caro. Even Carl. a blind pig finds a truffle occasionally. Which I had the same. Which one had the same dice games as two? Oh, good, good, fantastic. Ha! As if it would be that easy. I think, uh, yeah, it wouldn't surprise me if they. It depends if they're remaking it or whether they're remastering it. <sighs> uh, let me know when you have a clue. Oh, this is an awful puzzle. I did like the chess puzzle in this game, though. By one? You're pushing your luck, Dimitri. I just... What I honestly do not understand is the pattern of why certain... Why certain bits... Too much like, of a light strain up other bits. on your little... Hey, Vigren! Nice to see you, too. We are, we, do, we are literally just smashing our head up against this. I don't know what the correct answer is. I don't quite understand how What's we get the to matter, the correct Carl? answer. So Can't I'm just going to keep without your cue cards. keep going until until we stumble across it by chance. I've seen like I don't know why that highlighted than you. all of those. <laughs> More like the micros. Oh, we're playing against stealth. Oh, so I've got to get more. Right, right, right. I You're see. I your see. Luck, dimwit. Okay, I understand. Brute force can sometimes work. I agree. 
I agree. Sometimes if you don't know how a puzzle is meant to work. This looks like another case unsolved. Hey, I had more, more than he did. Remember, Badger, you are playing against Storf. <laughs> are you sure, okay? Are you sure? <laughs> Staff is actually inside all of us. Are they supposed to light up one at a time? Oh, dang. Is this gonna be something that they're like, oh, sorry, you can't play this on your PC because it's too quick? If you only had a brain. Curse you! I don't know how, but we did it. That was, that was the least satisfying puzzle I've ever done in my life. Skedaddled. So, running, but perhaps they're gonna say, did you know? Sked and addled are two words. I reckon that's, um, like desk. Desk. Desk daddy. Desk daddle. Desk. Desk, Ed, Ed, Edler, Desk. Deathlid, dead. Desklid. This is two words again. I knew it! I knew it! I told you so! I, it's gonna be desk. Desk something. Try getting out. Right. Good luck, Mr. Dimwit. All right, let's find a desk, I'm sure. Oh. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Okay, it's eight o'clock. Red, happy eight o'clock! Red, we're looking for Desk Daddy right now. Uh, if you see it, shout. I think new rooms opened up. Oh, I wonder. I hope they've got Desk Daddies in them. Oh, yeah. So there's bathroom, Ed Knox, and the game room. Right, where do you think we'll find Desk Daddy? I reckon Ed Knox sounds like a Desk Daddy, doesn't he? I think it's time. I think the time is triggered. I don't think we're on a. Um, I don't think we're on a timer to finish it because I spent like an like an hour on the chess one yesterday. Oh yeah, yeah. I wonder if I got a got anything older. Oh, it's the video. It's like no, you can't see the video. No, 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 no video for you. I don't think I can see the video unless I uh, go through all of the, through all the clues. I think the game room says that. No video for you. I'm presuming that we have to make it to the eleventh hour, so we're at the eighth hour. Hopefully, after we find Desk Daddy, maybe. There should be Desk Daddy's room or the bathroom. I think it's the bath. Oh! Wow. I've heard bathing and milk. <laughs> Not of it! Not of this! Thank you very much for giving us some Desk Daddy. You found him! Thank you very much, Anonymous. Welcome in, Desk Daddy. I was gonna say, I've heard that bathing and milk is really good for your skin. I didn't know that bathing in Heinz beans did you any good, though. I don't see any puzzles. Ah, he looks quite happy though. Oh, that's a puzzle. Oh, 
my god, I love this puzzle! Do you remember this puzzle from the last game? Yeah! I remember. We've got to get all of the spiders to the correct colour eggs. That's not it, Carl. And it seems like I've got a limited number of moves as well. I'm just trying to get the the orange spiders into place. Now we get the white spiders. That's not it. No, they were they were all in the they were all in the correct place. I could have done it in a couple of moves. I wonder if I can... <sighs> if there's a way, if I do this and then this, if there's a way... No, okay. I was wondering if I could get them to the kind of the center line. I don't quite understand how they want me to do that. I swear that was the most efficient way. I could do... Oh shit, well I wasted a turn there. Good. And if at first you don't succeed... Try, try, try again. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, when you were playing against Stauf in the first game it would actually say so. Whereas this it's like, oh, who, you know, why are these... I thought I was triggering... The, you know, I would click something and then it would trigger some of them to turn grey, if that makes sense. Hey, let's play a prank on Darkrow and food and poop. <laughs> yeah, sure, except quest. Hey, Darkrow, I made this, this really good chocolate pudding. I don't know if you, uh, don't know if you want to try it. Bathing in beans had the added, added benefit of dinner while oh, you soak. <laughs> Oh, honey, thank you very much for making me my bean bath. Oh, great, you got my favorite spoon and everything. Okay, I think I see a way to get the white ones in place fairly easily. That's not it. How many fucking moves does he give me? Okay, we're gonna check. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 17. He does not give me this many moves. Does it just not count if I'm doing if I'm moving them the same? Is there like a limit on how many times I can move the orange ones maybe?
Maybe it knows you're trying to trick it. I'm just trying to, I'm just trying to learn what the game wants from me. I'm not trying to trick you, game, I swear. It, do you see this, like, invisible spider here as well? You're just guessing. Seems to be another criteria for failure. I looked at the walkthrough. I didn't look at the. Uh, I didn't want to look at the. This the what's it called? Um, the solution. I just wanted to look at kind of what we're trying to do. And it literally is just like you now want to swap the white and the brown flower, uh, the white and the brown spiders around. Yeah, that proceeds to just give me the answer. There's no. I don't want the answer. I want. I want. I want to know like what the criteria for swapping them is. You know, this should be my wedding song. <laughs> would you include the sounds of the spider scurrying as well, or would you? Uh, would you admit <laughs> admit those? Um... I never cheat. No, 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 no. Uh, I want staff to insult me. <laughs> Just don't have him ask if you've been inbreeding at your wedding, because, like, then they're not going to let you get married. This is the quickest way. I don't... Maybe I don't... Okay. Maybe once one spider gets in place, I've only got so many moves to solve it before... They all have to be in place. Does that sound crazy? Just try some stuff. That's not it. See? Just something. Something is triggering it so it doesn't... Doesn't work. Oh, the link will automatically get removed from, uh, from chat. Experience. If I wanted them, I wouldn't. <laughs> Even if I wanted them, I can't have them. Maybe. All right. 
Maybe. I've got an idea. Now both of these are in the position to get to their orange spots. But they're not crossing paths. This game was made to sell him books. 7 moves a move is complete when another spider is selected okay okay so I can make as many moves with a single spider as I want so I guess I want to get myself into a position where I can make multiple moves with the same spider so that would mean moving a spider out the way so that the other spider has a clear runway to make multiple moves. Okay, I've got an idea. Two moves. We're on two moves. So now this spider has a clear, really clear runway. fifth one. Five moves. You got lucky that time. Thank you guys. Thank you. <laughs> okay, that was good. That was good. 
After after I knew that I had to move the spiders out of the way so that they would get a clear runway, okay. That was good. Alright, I quite like that puzzle. That puzzle was okay. <laughs> There's so much so many beans in that bar. Oh, a nice hot water bottle. That looks really fleshy and I don't like it. First try, Badger does it again. Okay, we've done the bathroom. Now we thought Ed Knox's room might be desk daddy because he sounds like a desk daddy. It's what you call a full English room. <laughs> remember that being there in the first game. I remember! I remember this rug! I remember this rug, I don't... I don't remember that. We got some wine. What the hell the fuck that is? Oh my god, what the... Oh, it's a slidey puzzle. I like slidey puzzles. Okay. Yeah, I can jam with a slidey puzzle. Oh, it's me. So these two go together. I don't remember which the top pieces were, though. Oh, it's a really nice sound as well that you get from the puzzle. Oh, they go together. Oh. I might have gotten them wrong way around. No, no. Oh, that looks about right. No. The circle's complete. They the... Oh, the circle's just my light. Never mind. Yeah, the circle's my flashlight. An idiot. What an idiot. Oh, yeah, what a nice circle! I think... <laughs> Maybe it is a bit. It kind of looks like a moon. Uh, I, yeah, I think I've got these, the, these plates the wrong way around, which is a little bit... I mean, it's it's more than a little bit annoying. It's a lot annoying. Just again. Uh, uh, let me know when you have a clue. Thank you. I mean, that looks done, like it's done. Oh, oh, I see. Okay, it's done. It's showing me that. Right. I was right. It's much easier doing it the other way. You don't like the. You do not like. Um, I, I'm a big fan of a uh, uh, slider puzzles. <laughs> I think because they're a little bit. They're just simple. They're easy. Everybody knows how to do them. You know. I say as I kind of. I'm not really fucking it up. It's alright. You hate them. <laughs> I quite like them. I 
Hey, that fun. Yeah, they're like just they're nice and uh calming. This may be the word. Oh, I've gotten myself into a bit of a pickle. Yeah, it's a nice break from other puzzles. You just sit and you click around. There, right, we got this side sorted. Come back when you can make what? an appearance. No! I clicked out of the puzzle! <laughs> Fuck off, Stauf, that I clicked out of the fucking puzzle. Oh my god, I'm so mad. Oh, I've nearly done this puzzle. Great. Oh, I love slider puzzles. You know what? I love slider puzzles so much, I couldn't wait to do this one again. Just couldn't wait. I was like, no, no, no. I want more. Doing this slider puzzle once isn't enough. I have to do it again. There, right, we got that side all sorted. Oh, these two are in the right place. That's gotta be here. Back for more. Oh yeah, more slider puzzles. Okay. Back for more. Stuff's so shocked that anyone enjoys this puzzle. Wow. My most successful puzzle yet. For some reason, I seem even more confused. This is night AS, nice ASMR, though, right? Yeah, this is a slider puzzle channel now. Be doing nothing but slider puzzle. Hope you guys are okay with that. I just seem to be in a real pickle with this one. I don't know why. I don't know what's quite gotten me into this pickle. Going. It's going all right. I'm having an okay time. An okay time doesn't sound that good, does it, though? No, I'm, yeah, I'm having a good time. Yeah, it's all right. Uh, a little bit of a pickle with a bit of a slider puzzle here, though. All right, there we go. There we go. That's what I wanted. And then this can go up here. Now we're partially... Gosh, we're on our way to finish this puzzle. Just can't quite figure out which which bit goes right there. Come back. When oh you can my make god! An Why is that the exit? <laughs> there, there's a pixel. There's a pixel. There's a pixel. Look, this bit, right here, where am I clicking? Am I clicking to leave the game? Absolutely not. I am right in the middle of a slide right here. Like, look at this. All of this zone is exit the puzzle. All of it. This means I can click on the, the puzzle bits. All of this, which is over three quarters of this bit of the slidey, is exit puzzle. Same on the other side. It's like I'm 
Oh, I just can't get enough of the slide puzzle. I'm so glad they've designed it this way so I get to play it again. Just take your time clicking. I just get, I get so excited by the slidey puzzle. I don't want to take my time, you know? Do that one. They call me Captain, Captain Slider. Yeah. Oh, that goes there as well. That's nice. Did you know slide and puzzle are two words? <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea actually, no idea. This puzzle's so nice she's gonna play it twice. I'm not even gonna play it twice. I'm gonna play it. This is the third or fourth time I've been so thrilled to play this puzzle. I am... You know I'm almost speechless. I'm almost speechless with how much I love this puzzle. Thank you, Rooks. <laughs> At least I've got this side completely done now. Look at that. Once, twice, three times a sliding. Now I just gotta figure out what all of this goes. Bah, 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 bah. Pretty sure these go on the other side of one another. I guess the hope is that I don't fuck up the- yeah, there we go. I don't fuck up the top line, trying to fix the bottom. And if we pull this... So we kind of got a bit of space to work with. Oh, I'm just doing it wrong there. That goes like that, so but just kind of two out of place. I don't think I can fix. That's just going to put it back to work. Did Stow finally get my self-confidence? Oh, talking about that kind of, um, that reminds me of the Deep Space Nine <laughs> episode I watched last night. I watched the one where um, Julian um, was in that mental battle with uh, the teleconnect telekinetic guy. Really good episode. Thoroughly enjoyed that. Okay. I love Julian and Garrick's uh, relationship. I fucked up my puzzle. I'm sure it's fine. I've just undone everything I just did. I think I did. <laughs> I think I did. Stauf is an anagram for Faust. Dr. Faustus. next to each other though. That's pretty good. So if we can okay I did I did something quite unintentionally but I did it nonetheless.
these are in the wrong places now, though, which is really annoying. Um. there's like a really quick and easy way to do this that I'm just not not getting but I don't know. I'm pretty sure these two are supposed to go over the far left okay. maybe here which would mean that uh, I can't really see what that is And I think perhaps these two go to the to the left, to the left, to the left. Oh, really? What for, bread? Is it for lower decks? Come on, I thought that would be right. I've heard lower decks. I like, whenever I've asked you guys, you've always said that lower decks is really good. I'm a kind of, I guess I'm kind of a bit dubious if, if it's my kind of thing, whether I'd enjoy it or not. Oh, I think... Do I see what I meant to be doing? Yeah, I do. Oh, I kind of wanted to dump it here. Maybe I fucked it up. I think one of these goes on either side. I think this one goes at the end and these two go in the middle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it is my uh, my first um, my first watch through Deep Space Nine. I've watched a. Uh, together at the different th okay they go together a different way than I expected sure okay that is it kind of changes what I thought was gonna happen all right the music is nice I know what I'm doing? No. Uh, will we find out if this works? Yes. I think it wants to be... I think maybe this will be fine if I just keep newt newting.
That looks like it. That's such a hard cut. That kind of looks like it fits, but I don't think it does. It did work. Okay. Right. Now we have these two. <laughs> now we have those two together. Which I'm unsure exactly where they go in the puzzle. Whether they go kind of either side. Um... So I'll see you later! Oh, you make sure the doggo has a wonderful walk. I'll see you later. Mm. I don't want to miss click again either. It's happening in the comics. Ooh, is Cisco? I know Cisco always said that he wanted to stay a commander. I think the episode where he had his friend who was in the Marquis, it was mentioned that they didn't think Cisco would ever do well as an admiral. So I wonder what they're going to have him doing. I think the top is all pretty much correct, I guess. Mm -hmm. Admirals don't get to go about like doing stuff. He doesn't get to be on the front lines or anything. It means that he would kind of get a get a cushy desk job, but it doesn't really suit him. That didn't look like how I thought it would. everything up. How did I do that? What did I do to get myself into this position? I was just sliding. Oh no. No, I was just sliding about. What did I do? Oh no. When did this happen? I was just sliding about. I just slid too much. Come back when you can make an appearance. Oh. <laughs> That's so anger inducing. I don't want to hear a word, guys. I don't want to hear a single word about how I clicked out of it again. Are you trying to think? I don't I don't want to hear a word about or it. Or have a move. Right? What I want to see is this. I want to see this. So I'm all correct on that.
We'll all be dead by the time you saw. Okay, so raged, ra raged, raised edge goes up here. Those two go over here. I think the missing square is the middle one over here. Okay. It's bigger than it looks. Okay, it's a diff. It seems to be randomized. Which, perhaps, which one is missing? These two fit together. Like that. Like that. Right, we've done the bottom line. Now we just have to do the top line. We know how the top line looks because we've done that 50 gazillion times. So we shouldn't need to think about it too much. It's like angry. So angry. Now we just have one out of place. We can get that. The moon is supposed to be round, eh, Momo? Now we just have one out of place. We've done it. We've done it. Lads. 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 Curse you! We did it. Lads. We did it, lads. That was infuriating. And it wasn't even the fucking shuffle puzzle. It was so infuriating. It was the fact that I had such a small margin of error with the shuffling at the end. Shuffle lads. First try. Yeah, just made a couple of boo-boos. Your brain is addled. Right. GG, lads. GG. Reality. What <laughs> a concept. Hey, Carl! Off we go. I think my next Star Trek watch might be Next Generation. I know I do want to watch Enterprise because I want to see... I feel like I'm watching the backwards from Voyager because Deep Space Nine came first, uh, then Enterprise happened before that. So I am considering watching Enterprise because I kind of want to see uh, the Miles O'Brien lore. But... Is this not the doll room? You think the next generation is better than Enterprise? O'Brien is in Deep Space Nine, but it didn't he was originally from Enterprise, wasn't he? He served on the Enterprise. Sadly, see, I haven't lost interest in Buffy. I haven't, I promise. I just haven't, um... I haven't gotten the fourth, uh, fourth season yet. He starts in the next generation. He does! Oh! Okay, so I should watch the next generation first, right? Alright, we're looking for a desk, by the way, as well. Mm, okay. Or maybe I'll watch the next generation. It'll take me ages to watch it anyway. Because, like, it took me a year in order to... Or maybe even it took me two years in between Voyager and... Deep oh, Space Nine. Now, you're just guessing. Well, I don't know what the staff... I don't know what I'm doing. Of course I'm just guessing. 
Duh, that's not it, Carl. Carl. Play it again, Carl. I don't know why this, for some reason, on. I think I have to finish there. I think I've got to finish in either one of these corners. Duh, that's not it, Carl. Yeah, I heard um, the first couple of series of Deep Space Nine were very good, but I didn't mind. Honestly, I didn't mind them. I thought they were, I thought they were good. But having lyrics in the theme song. Oh, are you telling me I get, I get something to sing along to, Chad? While I watch the uh, watch the opening. Enterprise stopped when it got its footing. Is it quite short then? Hey, Los, are you feeling lonely? Okay, for some reason this seems to be working. That's not it. Why is it not it? <laughs> I think this was right though. Ooh, close, but no cigar. Play it again, Carl. And if oh, piss. I meant to click succeed. on the other one. Now I just look like I'm trying the same <laughs> thing over and over again. I swear I'm not. Maybe I go? No. It's just so... I don't super duper understand what the rules are to this even, you know? Now, you're like, just it's guessing. The, 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 the last ball is next to the eight. I don't understand why I can't go there. Where do we start before we started up here? Play it again, Carl. Stuck like this. There's a new Star Trek series aimed more for kids. Oh, is that is that Lower Decks? I didn't know if that one was aimed a little bit more for a little bit more for a younger audience. Oh, Star Trek Prodigy. That's I don't understand why I can not go left here, but I can go right. And if at first you don't succeed... <laughs> yeah, Prodigy has the holo, holo Janeway. That's... Yeah. That's the one that I was thinking. I think almost every time I've talked about Lower Decks, I've been meaning Prodigy. Oopsies! So I know this is the wrong way. Oh, I hate that. Why are you doing Play this Play it again? again, Carl. I'm just... Just trying it out. Maybe if we go... I just don't understand why I can't go right here. I don't want to use up this... I feel like this is almost the god now, space. You're the just middle space. guessing. Chad, I'll see you in a mini. What if we look? From each ball, your movement is limited somewhat, and where you can move next is really arbitrary. There is no way of determining it by trial, trial and error. Oh, what an amazing puzzle. That sounds like a great design for a puzzle. I can really tell they put a lot of thought into this puzzle. Mmm. Oh, I like that they've made it arbitrary. That's fun. What if we kind of do a triangle here? 
But it doesn't work the opposite way. I don't know if it works this way. I can't go one, two, three, four. It's fine. Right. I feel like we might have used the middle ball up too early. Play it again, Carl. You know what? Maybe Carl is sick and tired of playing it again. Is it random as well? Can I go around like this? You Did got I... lucky that time. I mean, I wouldn't call. I wouldn't. Good night. Don't let the bed bugs bite. I don't feel like I don't feel like it was luck, or I'm well, maybe Using it was luck. Using up the middle ball too quickly, just like your mum did. Yo, epic Joe colored. Garlic, <laughs> garlic, thank you. Oh, Galax. I do like a your mum joke. Yeah. I still, I don't, I still don't understand. No, I've got no idea what was going on with that puzzle. Bowling. No, so we're looking for, so we're looking for a desk. Remember? You reckon there'll be a chess puzzle? No. We're yet to find one. Oh. I wrote mum, so all of the British people could understand what I was saying. Well, I would say that your mum jokes are better than your mom jokes. Just, uh, just on a personal level. Did I save after I did that? Right. Uh, Huh. Right, we've played all of the puzzles available to us now, so we've got to... We've got to now find a desk. Oh, I don't remember seeing a desk. I've got a Mr. Kipling cake here. Were we talking about Mr. Kipling cakes yesterday? I feel like, Rooks, you said something about Mr. Kipling cakes yesterday. Uh, have I seen a desk? I would presume there would be a desk in the library, but I don't. Maybe in the lab. The library. So you can see it's skedaddled. And um, the anagram of skedaddled is uh, desk. Desk. Um, Desk ad, desk. Um, I feel like it's desk dead, deadle, desk deadle. That's. <laughs> I all I can come back out of it. Um. But I was kind of convinced that we were going to find a desk in one of the new rooms that opened up. Oh yeah. We got a cake. We got a munchy cake. Hmm. I did um I did do a bit of research on the actor who plays um Julian Bashir and um I didn't realize that he was in Game of Thrones. He was um Oberon Martell, I think. What's this? Oh my god, hello, tiny pirate. <laughs> 
what a tiny, what a tiny, t tiny skeleton pirate. We've got another sexy painting. Got a light. Got a glass of wine. This bed doesn't even have a mattress. What is the, uh, what's the new Star Trek movie? <laughs> There's so much ketchup on the floor. That has a seven of nine in it. Desk. Desk. I would say they're coming along great. We we struggle. I'm happier when we're in an actual, actual puzzle. Oh, she's not in any of the movies. She's in Picard. That's what I was thinking of. That's what I was thinking. I say we struggle the most when we're stuck with the anagrams. That's kind of, uh, I feel like, where we sink our time the most. I bet there's a desk down in the lab. <gasps> Do you think the Witcher 1 remake will have the 4K sex cards that you can collect? Do you think they'll take them out of it, Galux? So I know they got, um... Oh, is this a desk? Norgan is Go a desk? ahead, Carl. Make my day. Maybe this is a desk? No, that's a sconce. Alright. Oh, missed! You gave it a shot, but <laughs> you missed! <laughs> <laughs> Very funny, Scal! Very funny! <laughs> Everyone laughs! Stout said something funny! Now everyone is pissed. Maybe we should play Mist instead. This is a desk. This is a desk. This is a desk, right? Hello? Is anybody home in there? Hey, I'm a raid. It's your turn, sport! I did have some pretty bad nightmares last night. So I think that spooky games are finally, like, a, kind of getting to me. Is today a good day to die? The Come. riddle was, uh, skedaddled. Skedaddled. So that's an anagram for desk. Is, de is desk something? Desk, desk, deddle. Desk a deddle or something. Um... I mean, I didn't, I didn't need this to, I didn't need this clue, but. You still got, we still, still got Monday. We still got Monday to go. I am still debating about playing maybe the uh, Resident Evil DLC, but it is very much a maybe. Desk Daddle. Oh yeah, Desk Daddy. Desk Daddy. But I'm yet to find a desk. Playing obscure puzzle games like this would give me much worse nightmares than any horror game ever could. <laughs> I just, I just have so many nightmares that I'm stuck in a house and I have to solve these inane obscure puzzles to get out. Halloween can always go in at overtime. Yeah, I was debating whether I might play the um, Resident Evil DLC and go into November a little bit. Why did the chicken go to the scenes to talk to the other side? That is an absolute fucking curse, TTS. That is awful. <laughs> if I start the DLC, will I want to finish it? I think I want to finish it. I don't know how long it is. I feel like I need to look into it a little bit more, but I haven't wanted to get spoilers for it. 
uh, for the end of the actual main game. Right, we're gonna get another hint. Addled, Addled. means all mixed up. Mixed up desk? I know, I know what addled means. Sked is an anagram of desk. Thank you. Hint system. Thank you. You know, I hadn't realized that. Is that it? The hints I get. Maybe it's just desk mixed up. Has anyone ever spoiled a game for me? Um, I have, um, I have spotted some comments that have given away some bits of the game. Um, I think uh, during Danganronpa we had someone who was, uh, who was quite spoilery as well. So I think at the end of Danganronpa. Oh, desk. Robin said that you shoot blanks. This is the first one. <laughs> I think I got some bits spoiled for me. Um, but in general, I feel like... It's not a desk. <laughs> no, that was a... Is that a backgammon board? Uh, so occasionally I've had bits and bobs spoiled for me. Along, it's great. Yeah, I always think it's a bit. Oh, it's a desk! There's a desk! There's a desk! Desk. Yes. Okay, we've done something. Yeah, I always think it's a shame when someone uh, spoils like story elements of the game or because oh there seems to be like a little mouse hole under here, do you see it? It's like if you if you wanted to tell me what was gonna happen and not see my reaction to it. Just watch a walkthrough of the game. <laughs> just watch a walkthrough rather than um like otherwise there's no kind of point watching a stream of it, right? The whole fun of a stream is to kind of experience it together. I don't know. Oh yeah, that's what I did with Resident Evil Village because I accidentally got a spoiler for Resident Evil Village on uh, Twitter because they obviously announced the DLC and I saw um, that something... Uh, some I don't want to spoil it now, just in case anyone wasn't there while I spoiled it, because uh, I shared what spoiler I saw without even thinking about it. Um, I, because I, I guess, I guess for me in that instance, I was thinking, ah, oh, you know, it's, uh, I guess we're experiencing the game together, and uh, and I just, I just didn't, didn't think. Um, basically, someone I saw that someone was alive at during the DLC so I I now know that they end up alive at the end of the game essentially so I got that a little bit spoilery nah no one's been naughty bread no one's been naughty uh, Chad just asked if anyone's ever spoiled a game for me and I said that I have I have had I have had some spoilers and I was just saying that we um maybe Ever play Doctor, Carl? That it's uh, always a shame, always a shame when um, when you have some of the story for something spoiled, especially when you're kind of experiencing experiencing it. Like uh, I would have never. Um, you think I'm done with the riddle? 
part of the body oh, am... examined in doctor's office. That was straight. I feel like they should have been like, oh, congratulations, you've done. I That's the heart. I know the answer to this riddle. I feel like they should have said congratulations, you're down with the riddle. I thought I had to open... I thought I was here having to open the fucking desk in a certain way. I think uh, I was... You know, like I was going to say, at the end of Sinny uh, with Sacrifice, I had no idea what was going to happen, and it was, a, it was a real surprise for me. Mm. Oh, yeah, sometimes it definitely happens by accident. Like, I've nearly, I've nearly spoiled a game in somebody's chat before by accident and uh, I only kind of realized that I would be I I was get I was talking to them about the game or something and I wrote something out I reread it because I always reread my messages like five times to make sure that you know I don't think I want to be going up here do I want to go up here I think I'm going the wrong way uh, <laughs> and I was like oh oh that would be it no I don't want to say that that would be a spoiler so I and you know I didn't want to say it um, yeah, I did have one person at the end of Danganronpa that didn't, was just absolutely insist on all giving spoilers. That was a long time ago, though. Yeah, I almost, I almost did it by accident. Mmm, yeah, if someone says, oh, what did you think of this, uh, this book or something? You want to be able to say, oh, I really enjoyed the, the twist when the thing happened, but it's, you know, or... Oh, what did you like about this movie or thing? It's really difficult not to describe it with spoilers. Can I not go in here? Let me in! Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's always difficult to know, isn't it? Because you don't want to... I don't want to spoil Pillars of Eternity for anyone, but at the same time, you want to be able to discuss something that... Um you know, that you've, you've played, if that makes sense. If you don't succeed, try again. Oh, yes, six! According to the Capcom DLC story, finished in four hours. Four hours. Thank you very much, Sek. Thank you. So that's not too bad. That's like one stream. So maybe, may, okay, maybe if we finish Resident Evil tomorrow, it would be a nice special Halloween stream on Monday if I did the Resident Evil. If I did the Resident Evil um, DLC, wouldn't it be? That would be that would fit really nicely. And Ian, you dreamed you were doing a corporate event. Oh, I was emceeing. You. <laughs> you were talking over a teleconferencing bit. I couldn't figure out why until. <laughs> Uh, I'd be I'd be great at a teleconferencing event. I'd be great. <laughs> the thing is, sometimes I catch the message, I think about it, and then I just don't get the words out of my mouth. But then, if if I haven't said anything about it, I immediately forget that I've read it as well. I think I want to go in this room. I always, I always, whenever, like, um, should say, I say you should do DLC to assemble what, where I do DLC for everything, like, um, oh, what am I thinking, Dragon Age, uh, I think you have DLC that I haven't done. Dragon Age, uh, Resident Evil Village, I guess. Uh, is there anything else I haven't done the DLC for? We do actually have a, uh, a New Vegas. Yeah, that's a good point. Janky January. So in November, our games will be... We'll be playing Hitman 3. Hitman 3. And we will be playing Thief 2 in November. There are November games. Um, and then December, we have some very fun, very special Christmas streams coming up. Uh, there will be a Channel Point Goal running uh, 
either the start of November or halfway through, uh, start of December or halfway through November, I think, uh, for a special stream that hopefully, hopefully we'll reach the goal and we'll do it. Um, uh, I don't, you know, I won't, I won't reveal anything now. I'll keep you, I'll keep you in suspenders. But I did put a, put a bit of a, a sneaky peek of what we're going to be doing in December and it will be on original hardware and this will be my first original hardware um it'll be my first original hardware stream especially for Christmas go get your head examined wait no was that not the answer I, I part of the body examined in the doctor's office Organ toenails. Or like an organ? What's your favorite body part to examine? Yeah? Is that, was that right? Oh. No. Okay. <laughs> I was like, yeah. Yeah, I came. I know it's a. Uh, it's pretty difficult on Twitch in particular because each stream has their own set of what you can say and what you can't say, and like if they do like hints, if they don't like hints. And I know, I I sometimes sit in streams and I'm like, oh dang, am I allowed to say? <laughs> am I allowed? To, am I not? Not that I've necessarily wanted to give them a hint, or a, it was it was something else. Um, I think I was fairly new to the stream and I didn't know if, like, if some of my inappropriate jokes, if it would be taken well. Like, it was nothing super duper inappropriate. I'm sure it, I, I'm sure it was just something like toe jam or something. Um, it's really difficult to know how certain things, I, I guess that's the same with real life, right? You go into different circles and different people think that, that different, you know, you know, some people are going to talk, ah, no, it's about my poop. Yeah, somebody asked, they were like, Oh, hello, Captain Badgetail, how are you doing today? And I was thinking, I wanted to say, Oh, I just had a great poop. Because I did, and I was just sitting there being like, I don't know. Don't know how this is going to be taken. I don't know, I don't know how this is... <laughs> I don't know how this is going to be taken, so I won't it say that. It must be another name for a body. A cadaver? Another name for a body. Um... A cadaver, a another name for a body. A corpse, yeah. A skeleton as well. An option. Yeah, just a read chat, get a read for the room. Yeah. Luckily, we understand and generally share your sense of humor. <laughs> Just took a great shit today, guys. Maybe it's the skelly bob upstairs. Where's the skelly bob? Yeah, if you just walked into a bar and started chatting, people love you. <laughs> Yeah, if you just walked into a bar and you were like, hey guys, I had a great shit. People might think you're a bit strange as well, so. <laughs> I think there's a bathroom here somewhere. I don't know, that's just. My room. Oh fuck! I forget that you you always face the opposite way. Just keep coming into the same room.
the skeleton does not want you in the tub, Carl. Is that... Okay, that's not the answer. That's not the answer. Mm. I think also some streamers um, get super worried about spoilers because they've had games before. So I can understand why um, some, uh, some streamers are super, super strict on it. Um, I don't know. I feel like I kind of lie in the middle. I don't want the game spoiled for me and I don't want, it, um, don't want the story spoiled for me. So I will, like tell people that I don't want this to be spoiled and when it comes to puzzles I feel like I don't want to be told the answer if you know the answer don't just tell me the answer um, but for the like for these really obscure uh, anagrams I've been I've been enjoying something with them with you it's been quite nice um, yeah like with uh, with other puzzles I tend to say give me a chance to solve them and, and eventually I usually will break down and ask you guys for a hint um, Bobble, why are you mega revolting? Bobble? Click on the ass in that picture. Oh, that's what I really want to examine. <laughs> the doctor's office. <laughs> when I see a proctologist. Examine, examine the body of the sentence. Oh, no. It's hidden in the words doctor's office. It, is that a fucking anagram? Mm. Fucking anagram, isn't it? Or it's hidden in the body of the... I can't be orifice, can it? Because what orifice would I be like? What, or <laughs> what orifice? Yeah, I think it, it does make a difference who is who is giving the kind of... Like, yeah, if it's someone new who just tells you to, like, do something versus maybe someone that you know who, you know, someone that has been in chat a lot, that... And they tend to know... Uh, you know, they, they tend to know when the hint is perhaps wanted or when... Yeah, it's, it's, it's difficult, though. It's difficult. Mouth... <laughs> Great, it's dinner time. Doomsday, you gotta get something in the or <laughs> orifice. <laughs> Throat, nose, ass. <laughs> it's a torso. What? Oh yeah, I guess that. I like how she exclaims, it's a torso. Like, oh yeah, don't, yeah, I know the torso that's just like, there is actually a torso lying around that I do know. I do know where it is. Yeah, chat cred, exactly, exactly. You gotta have the right amount of cred. <laughs> oh dear. Surprise, it was a torso. Now, I think, so. you know, some people do let the spoilers slip by accident and, um, I'd never, I'd never ban on the, f like, if maybe, like, if it was someone who came in chat and was just like, oh, the ending for the 11th hour, like, never seen them before, first chat, the ending of the 11th hour, wrote it out, maybe I'd ban them. Maybe, maybe I'd ban them, maybe I'd just time them out for the rest of the stream. Maybe I'd time them out for the rest of the stream. I think, uh, I think the torso is in the art place. But I tend to like to give people another chance just in case it was an accident. Ooh, bad move. But I mean, that doesn't sound like it was an accident, so... No. You know, it doesn't say if someone came in and said the end of it. <laughs> Did you see those Resident Evil, Evil spoiler raids with everyone whose name was a spoiler to the game? No way! Oh, dang! <laughs> the ending, oh yeah, 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 I wouldn't even, bam, just after looking, I've been looking for a reason to get rid of you, just gonna, <laughs> yeah, there was a torso in the bottom, you're right. Oh, I sh you? she looked I'd like to cranky. see Dr. Thornton if he's available. He's available? You a patient of his? No, I. I'll fill this out. 
Actually, I'm not here as a patient. I'm a producer for Case Unsolved, the TV show. I'd like to interview him. Can I go right to the beginning? No, I can't. I don't get to see the FMV beforehand. I want you to cosplay based on this game. I'd have to get my perm first, right? <laughs> huh? Libation for an affectionate puppy called Sound. I don't even know what that word means. I don't even I don't even know what that word means. It's a drink. Oh, okay. Oh shit, there was uh, there's a picture of a dog somewhere. It's an alcohol, a beverage, a drink poured as an offering to a deity. Okay, so it's like wine. Like the Jesus wine that was up in that guy's room. I mean it wasn't specifically Jesus wine, it was just normal wine, but there was a there was some wine in that guy's room. Like Jesus. <laughs> No, like, you know, wine you would have at a communion, I guess. Or a, um... Oh, God, what are they called? Uh, mass. Love me some Jesus. I saw some, I saw some wine here. You love puppies, Carl. Barbecued or broiled. Hey, it turns out it was not that. Uh, there's one other puppy thing that I can think of before I ask for the next hint. <laughs> do they not give you like separate wine? Like, do they not give it to you in like little, little plastic cups so you can each have a little Little sip, do you have to share the pot? Do you have to share the cup? Oh, now you gotta share the cup. I think, uh, I was just thinking, surely that's not COVID safe. And then, um, in my brain, I then remembered the. <laughs> You know, uh, when <laughs> the pictures of the priests baptizing kids with water guns because of COVID. I really, I really, <laughs> really enjoyed that part of COVID. Driving you to drink, <laughs> big guy? Okay, let's go. Sounder, Sounder might be a key clue. What does an affectionate puppy do? Piss on your feet. I don't, like, lick you? Hey, Stealthy! This game's making me feel lonely. No, it's all right. It's it's all it's all right. Uh, we're needing a lot of clues, though. We're needing a lot of clues. How are you doing, Stealthy? How's your How's your Wednesday? A drink could be alcohol. Oh, could it? It could be al it. Oh, never thought of that. That a drink might be alcoholic. Susie. <laughs> She's dead asleep. I'm here to help you with puzzle, mother. Liquor and liquor sound alike. <laughs> you like that, you pervert. <laughs> I've been called a pervert today. Hmm? Nick, how the fuck are you doing? How is your Wednesday going? People didn't like me grabbing the ass of paintings. I don't know why. Yeah, it's a pun. It's not a <laughs> it's not an anagram this time. Right, let's find some some li liqueur. Isn't it liqueur, not liquor? I get American, right? Americans. Hey, you oldie! I love me some liquor! Liquor where? 
Look at your mum! <laughs> They're two different things. Are they? Are they? What are they? Like, what's the difference between liqueur and liquor? A <laughs> Gen Z drink lit. <laughs> Oh, it's terrible. Terrible. Ah, uh, maybe there might have been some liquor. Alcohol percentage. Oh, it's like liquor, uh, like a spirit. You know, above 40%. Because I don't think we, we don't have liquor in the UK. This, yeah, it is, isn't he? He's like this. I like how sassy he is when he doesn't want me to, like, click on something he's like no oh so it's like a like a hard spirit okay, okay i'm with you i'm with you i'm picking up what you're putting down red okay, no liquor in this in this room i had to throw out some apricot liqueur i used to make charles lindbergh cocktails because I would use so little of it that it went bad. Does liquor ever go bad? Like, Bailey's is a forever drink, right? It never goes bad. Yeah, because, like, whiskey's a liquor. I was fiddling with my, uh, with some blue tack and I got it stuck in my nails. Oh, it's settled in a nasty way. You know, if you put Bailey's with, um, Bailey's with milk? Is it Bailey's with milk? It causes it to split? Is whiskey bourbon? 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 Ever drink Bailey's out of a boot? Funnily enough, I I actually I haven't. No, I haven't found it. Just don't put Bailey's in Guinness. Is that what makes it look like brains, Nick? Yeah, it curdles. I remember in, um, talking about curdling, I remember in school, I had a friend who put marshmallows in his mum's milk. So, when she poured it and drank it, it was, it was lumpy, obviously, he didn't, you know, it wasn't off, but it made her believe that it was off. Isn't that just a nice harmless prank? Because it doesn't do anything bad to the milk. Oh, I didn't mean to go through the confessional booth. No. Liquor, liquor, liquors, lick. Liquors are liquors which have had sugar and flavor added. Okay, so like a, like a. Yeah, like a Bailey's is Bailey's is whiskey, but with sugar and cream. Right. Just a prank, bro. Exactly, exactly. That's what. Hey, it's one of my more mild pranks. You know, guys, a, a funny, another fr funny prank is um, if um, if you're at someone's house that you don't like. Uh, did you know curtain poles are actually hollow? You can fill those curtain poles with a uh, poo, and they'll never know it's there. They'll never know it's there. They'll just, they'll smell it, but they'll never find it. Very funny prank. Don't try it in your own home, no. No. No, I see it. I'm sure I saw some liquors. What? Because <laughs> no one thinks to look in the curtain poles, do they? They're not going to go, oh yeah, you know, something smells like shit. Let me just check my curtain poles. No one's going to check. Acid. I'm sure, now I'm remembering I have seen some liquor. And how do you get in? Ah, uh, that's, you know, look, that's just small details of how I got in, why I'm there, when I'm leaving. You know, it's a t small, small, small details. Yeah, it's pretty.
pretty smart. It's pretty smart. Mm hmm. <laughs> she is off. It's uh, it's good if um, someone's inheriting the inheriting the house that you don't want to inherit the house. So like um, you know, say you are an angry family member that grandma's house is going to um, Uncle Jimmy, right? Before before the house goes to Uncle Jimmy, just shit in his curtain rods. I'll show him. <laughs> Nothing says winning a revenge like sticking someone's curtain rod up your bum. Look, I, you don't have to. You could pre-prepare the poo. You don't have to. You don't have to like. You don't have to there and then. You can pre-prepare it. I'm sure I've seen liquor somewhere. I I remember there's like some. Oh, I can't can't remember for the life of me where it is though. Yeah, you could freeze it first, and then it'll slowly defrost. Chug coffee beforehand. Stimulate those bowels. Yeah. Ed Knox's room had wine in it. The bathroom. Ah, oh, maybe it was in Brian's room. I solved it. It was. Oh my god. No, I haven't. No. Yeah, we're we're finding li liquor. Yeah, we did find- we found the torso. The torso was down in the art room. No, I- I've- I just- uh, just in case, you know, the FBI are watching, I've never shit in anybody's curtain rods. <laughs> Nor am I suggesting that anyone does shit in anybody's curtain rods, I'm just, you know... It was that uh, there was the- the stone torso lady in the art room. Okay, so this is Brian's room. It wasn't in Brian's room. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, well, you can't just do it in the bathroom. Who's got curtains in the bathroom? You usually have, like, blinds or something, and kind of rolling down your blinds and seeing a, uh... thing of skid markers and a subtle, you know? <laughs> What's your go-to excuse? <laughs> so thank you very much for giving us sub to X-Menza. Thank you very much. <laughs> Look at the weenies, X-Menza. Welcome back. <laughs> my excuse. My excuse is... Um, uh, I found it there. Right? I found it there. And I was helping them... I was helping them get rid of it. That would be my excuse. See, there's the tonic order up there. I I I saw that someone else was there stuffing it in their curtain rods. So I thought I would do the good deed. Remove it. Have I checked my own curtain rods? Well. You smell it first, right? So if I started smelling poop... Bad. Really, what I'm giving advice to everyone is not to poo in your own house curtain rods. But if your house smells like feces, so just check your curtain. You check your own curtain rods. I'm really just giving. I'm giving people puzzle-solving advice because no one would, no one would suspect it. Why does he keep saying bad move? Because he's a negative Nelly. That's why. Hello, Dogie. Hello. He is an. He's very negative. Now, where I've seen, I have seen the liquor. Are you ready to pop, Carl? Ah, you're pretty good, Bob, but they're pretty good. Solid. Okay. There doesn't seem to be any here. I've seen it. I just cannot figure out what room it's in. I'm sure it was Brandy. 
was in the gallery. So it's not in the gallery. Oh, we haven't been in the dining room. Have we been in the dining room? Maybe we haven't been in the dining room. I don't remember having been in the dining room. <laughs> A good prank. I don't think I've ever, like, successfully pulled off a prank on anyone. The most my pranks get to is hiding behind, like, a door and popping out and going, boo. That's, like, that's as far as my pranks go. Here? We haven't been in here. Oh, wow, what the fuck is that? What is that? I have a dead plant with more intuition. What is that? It's a spine. Oh, okay. I thought it looked like a column of caterpillar cake. What's the matter, Carl? Can't function without That's what his cars. dog was called? That's what his sure. His and dog I've was got called. This bridge you might like to buy. I'd never want to feed anyone anything as a prank because you never know when they're you would never know when they're allergic to something. What is that fork? Ready to it. snarl, Carl? Yeah, who calls that dog Sounder? And you'd feel real bad. You'd feel real bad if they were allergic to anything in the like laxatives or. Strike! Oh, do you see that little paw beans on there? Look at those. This is very cute. Like calling your dog Barker. It just reminds me of the time that you guys. Ophelia! They could have invested in a bigger chess set. Now, nah, now, nah, we can only afford one fifth of a chess set. We can only afford one fifth. One fifth of a chessboard and only four pieces. Ophelia, thank you so much for 35. 35 months, holy shit. As oh, the soul. Thank you so very, very much. You are the longest. I think that I think that's the longest streak. I think that's the longest, uh, longest, uh, longest tenure. Is tenure the right word? Ophelia, how are you doing? Thank you so much. How was your Monday? Friday, Wednesday. Columbo's dog was named a dog. Well, you know, look, Columbo... <laughs> Columbo had a lot of things to be thinking about and his dog's name wasn't one. Mm. We have a tenure here. Yeah. Yeah, it's like a like a university tenure. It's too bad that you can't increase your <gasps> brightness. Both my co-workers have COVID this week, so nothing has been happening at work, and I basically got the week off. Guys, I mean, I hope your co-workers are very uh, uh, you know, heal very quickly, and definitely don't take another week off. Is that the alcohol? This is acid. I've seen. Bird dropping smarter than you. I literally <laughs> have no idea. This. So once you've even got the item, you then have to do a Where's Wally quest to find out where the fuck it is. Don't mind me. I want to know. Uh... Oh, you 
you guys aren't gonna. <sighs> you guys will believe this. Yep, it's the champagne bottle again. May I know, champagne, not liquor. It's not liquor. Champagne isn't liquor. I was wondering if I could get some kind of beat going. Sorry. Don't mind me. Don't mind, don't mind me. <laughs> It'll never get old. Animal solid street. Right. Okay, so let's take the first letter of each word. And we get ass. And I know where one I know where one of those is. I know where one of those is. Alright, we've got to get back down to the gallery. Can we make that the alert sound when a new person enters chat? <laughs> Seen a lot of them. Oh, maybe we should actually go to a mirror. Considering our character's an ass. I'm sure if you do this long enough, something will happen. <laughs> I just feel like it doesn't give me much payoff, you know? I am... Um... I don't know what this could be, either. Like, in the seventh guess, we got a nice FMV movie after every kind of puzzle we did, which was a nice reward. Now we're called Carl. Sullied means messed up. Thank you, game. I know what Sully means. It's the street that is messed up. You know, this is like in an exam where they can't tell you the answer, but they can read out the question to you and tell you what each of the words mean. Street is an anagram of setter. An Irish setter. I don't want to even make a... I don't want to even... I don't want to even comment on that stupid... How would I get setter to Irish setter? Like... Am I supposed to... <sighs> Word from your mother crosses arms. <laughs> Honestly, these clues are stupid. They're stupid and I just spat everywhere. An iris setter is a dog. It's a type of dog, which this is not. Merde, eh, Carl? He's told me shit. He just said shit in French. Surely that's, that's not... That's... That's not okay, right? He just said merd. That's a Great Dane. You know Great Dane Doberman? Kind of looks, also kind of looks a little bit. Um, maybe German Shepherdy? Are you serious? Those are the clues I'm getting. Because, so with the stupidness that is, are these clues, we could go Irish setter. What is an Irish setter? A type of dog. What is a dog an anagram of? God! So we've got to go to the chapel, and it's in the chapel. You know, like that's the, that is, there is no indication when you get the correct answer to these clues. We're looking for God. What is Chaplin anagram of? Pelcher. And what does Pelch stand, uh, sound like? Sounds like pinch. And what happens when you get pinched? You get pinched on the first day of the month. And what, you know, so we're looking for a calendar. Hello, Vsauce Badger here. We're searching for God today. Cat 
you scoop up a solution? Oh, I think I actually do know where there's another dog, picture of a dog. Um, I don't know whether it's an Irish setup, but there is a picture of a dog, I think. Sounds windy. Because it's Wednesday, Wednesday, Craig. Craig, good morning. Thank you very much. How are you doing today, Craig? Ooh, bad move. I keep expecting him to say, oh, bad boy. What but Rob Red what? That guy just wants staff to call me a bad boy. There we go. Hey, what's the scoop? Did I get it? No. I just came here for the asses. I promise I didn't. I thought the dog. I thought that might have been the dog. It's in the game room, okay. Let's go to the game room. That creepy kid on the painting looks like. <laughs> that's the that's the picture they'll have. They'll have hanging in the Twitter lobby. <laughs> Send the painting to space. <laughs> Do 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 Vintage hay. Oh, vintage stay in Bordeaux. Chuck Grinder. What a name. What a name. Oh, maybe that painting there. That's not it, but if you hum a few bars. What? If I hum a few bars. There we go. But really, Doctor. What did it look like to you? Drop it, it was a mess. A bloody mess. I once met a man named Mike Rose. Perfect timing, by the way, Craig. Perfect timing. <laughs> so, let me start it from the beginning, guys. You know, tell you a story. Can I help you? I'd like to see Dr. Thornton. That's a really He's rude available. way to say hello to someone, though, isn't it? You a patient of his? No, I... I feel this out. Actually, I'm not here as a patient. I'm a producer for Case Unsolved, the TV show. I'd like to interview him. And then, so she's interviewing this guy. But really, Doctor, what did it look like to you? Game got you stuff. That's a good one, X Men. So that's a, a good one. Mess. Music's fucking jamming though! I don't know what he's doing. I mean, he's a doctor, so presumably treating Shifts the stump. Out, vix, quick, tick. Fu se rum umi cadiste e dog fu du corb cade decaden yem woyumi aze 
Doug. Oh, yeah. Why are we? Why are we in the Sims? Why? We're in the Sims? Well, uh, this game is the eleventh hour. I love ciphers, I do. I mean, usually it's nice when there's like a little bit of a clue as to what the cipher is. Do I own a notebook? I do actually. I did. I, I made sure I had one. I made sure I kept the one from last night. Yeah, from yesterday. Oh, you think it might be an anagram? Nah, there's not enough. Um, there's not enough vowels. Not enough vowels for an anagram, I don't think. Look, my my heart rate just went up. I was like, oh, hoo -hoo, a cipher. Hoo wee. Yeah, the single E might be a clue, so like you've got to think of what one letter word would make sense, and we're going for E's into A's, right? Maybe E goes into A, because that's the only one letter word that kind of works. Um, so I wonder if it's just A, is the alphabet but a long, um, or backwards, E to A, you know? Or it could be I, yeah, you're right, it could be I. Does E go to A or be I? Uh, probably I, because you probably wouldn't use it. Use it so often, maybe I. Let me just write out the alphabet because I never remember. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S T U V W X Y and Z. Now I know my ABCs. Next time, come and play with me. So E. So we go. Then H is D. E. Susie just farted. U C D C. Oh fuck, I fucked it up already. Okay. E is I, sorry. E is I M N O P Q R S T U B W X Y and Z. A, B, C, E, E, F, E. Oh no, something's gone to. Oh no, something's gone terribly wrong. <laughs> so I'm glad that you guys can't see this. I'm glad you don't. I, you don't. You can't see anything of what I'm doing. I was like, oh, this is kind of not, not good if I'm not showing everyone. But honestly, I don't want you to know how many times I've got the alphabet wrong. <laughs> Oh god, F comes before G. Um, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. I've really, fu I've really fucked this up somehow. I've got too many letters. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M N O P Q R S T What? Ah! ah! Oh god, dog! We got the zoom! <laughs> I think Chad was saying, oh, I didn't, you know, doggies never, never barked on stream. Jesus Christ. She's so insulted. She's so insulted. I don't know my, don't know my... <laughs> So it's so that I don't know why ABC just got the zoomies. Come here. You got the zoomies. Hmm? There you go. Yeah, so essentially she was just sitting in her bed. She was staring at me. 
vi- you know, her mouth was vibrating. She was staring at me because that's what uh, greyhounds do. They like chatter their teeth when they're excited. She was staring at me. Then I looked at her and that was, she was like, oh my God, zoomies. And uh, <laughs> it took me by surprise. She, uh, yeah, she's like, oh my God, zoomies. Okay. Thank you, mother, for looking at me and confirming that I can go and have zoomies now. Zuzu, mother is trying to decrypt the alphabet, so if you could please give me a moment. <laughs> She's assuming control of the stream. How can you not know your ABCs? Woof, woof, woof. Yeah, she was uh, she was having a nightmare. Um, last night, night before last, and uh, she was barking in her sleep, which was like. We woke up at like 3 a.m. Woof, woof, woof. So we had to get up, wake her up, you know, gently, so she didn't think that we were we were accosting her, and um, tuck her back into bed, tuck her back in, so she knew that she was okay. <laughs> Very cute though. I. I've got the cipher all written down. Yeah, dreaming of squirrels getting away, I bet. I bet. Right. I've got the cipher all written down. I did just rip it a little bit, but that's fine. Alright, so let's get this written out. So J. J to N. N. I don't think this is right, guys. N F Yeah, we learned that E equals I. And I perhaps wrongly assumed that it was just gonna be an offset. But apparently not. I I was wrong. Apparently it's not offset. Oh I just fucked it all up. I felt that if I if E was I, F would be M, G would be N, but apparently not. Okay. I love Caesar salad though. Right, let me write the alphabet out again. Hello, are you back? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Right. No, I think it's just random. I think it's literally random, um... <coughs> Oof. That was- oh, look! For the, for the spooky donation, thank you! Fuck! Scared the shit out of me! I thought it was- I thought it was the dog! Did I think it was you, hey? She's been such a pain. So... <laughs> Offline for months, I couldn't miss the chance!
can't believe it. I can't, I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe it. If, maybe a Q is an F? There's too many variables to it. So I'm thinking about these, this like EQ, which is, um, oh. Which would be something like I'm, it, um, I'm, something like if that. If this is I, then what is this? <laughs> if this is one, what is this? Thank you, Herbal. Thank you. Still hard to believe that that was a Nancy Drew game. It was scary. It was, I do, do we have a highlights of Nat Nancy Drew? Or maybe not. Yeah, it, if, I'm, it's got to start with I. It's got to start with I. Um. Because there's another Q up here. Oh, don't tell me. Don't tell, don't tell me, Tenere. Don't tell me. I don't want to know what it is. I want to work it. I want to work it out. I want to work it out. I don't want to know what the cipher is. I want to work out the... I want to work out the letters. Um. Yeah, it's either going to be is... I'm thinking maybe an S. Is it? Because we've got another two letter, a KF here, which could be, um. Sorry, I'll go up in the chat. It'll go up in the chat. I just keep my, keep my eye, keep my eye on the down. It's <laughs> fun, I'm pushing. Push it up, push it up, everyone! <laughs> Lift! Lift! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Lift, lift. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> now, Fred, we had a, we had a team building. We had a team building exercise. We lifted. We lifted. It's like being at the gym. <laughs> push it. Push it real good. Push it real good. Da da da. Da, 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 da. Thank you very much, TT. Thank you. Um, uh, see, that's the that's the nice attitude I like about like a uh, say if they if say I'm I'm like oh you know I don't I don't want um the spoiler. See, that's the I that's you know that's fun, right? Lifting it is fun. And everyone, you know, was really positive and everything. Just because we were talking about spoilers earlier. That was, that was nice. Uh, right, what do we want? K VX is also, also a two-letterer. So that would be something like am. Maybe V is am. Is there lots of Vs in the middle of words? No. You know, I am temp M is Y. I feel like M is my is Y. Because I feel like my by maybe. Maybe not. Maybe M is there's another like M in the middle of a word. Maybe S? No, because like what, what? I'm just trying to think of a two letter word that doesn't start, doesn't have an I as a starter. So like by, my, am. Maybe M is just M? Mm. I 
I think eventually I'll get to a point where I ask you guys what a word, what a what a letter might be. Trista by my crypt. But just for the moment, I think I want like a want to try and figure out what each of the letters are. But like posting two letter words is quite helpful actually. Two. Oh, two. See that so that doesn't tell me what the letter might be. It gives me suggestions. UK is a forearm jerk gesture offensive or is that pure European? Or oh, what, like when you drive past someone and you go at them out the window because they're a wanker. No, that's, in, that's, uh, that's bad in the UK as well. <laughs> Maybe two is a good idea. Two. Two on. Yeah, M could be N. Hmm. And I just want to say thank you to Denarium for being so positive about it as well. Just a little on the side. Oh, you know what? That's helpful, right? That R is S. R is S. I think. Because what else would that be? Yeah? Oh, it could be don't, it could be a T, right? <laughs> okay. I think that. Don't, I think that's a T. Oh, no, 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 scenario. No, thank you very much for being so positive about it. I do, I appreciate it. If it's if it turns into something fun, that's always good. Yeah, I think it because I was thinking like uh, stouts, like someone owns that. I think though, I agree that it's probably a T, like a don't. Or yeah, it's probably don't, right? X is probably D. You know what? Let's work under that assumption. M is O, A is A N. Um. So we can probably assume that that's on, and Y being O. L-M-N-A-O. Because Y... Oh no, never mind. Wait, right, we did... M is O. Oh. No. Yeah, no is a word. Do! Do! Maybe Y is D. It's a... Oh no, we've already got D, so... It would have to be no, right? Yeah, like Dan's. Mm. Yeah, we're presuming E is I because it's capitalized and everything. So, oh yeah, it could be an S. An S would probably make more sense. Because there's a lot of S's at the end of words. Let's find a word with a, an X in it. Right, this one's got an X in it. But the, I've said that X is D. But what is there two letter words that end with D? Is there any two letter words that end with D? I don't think there are. It eyed, yeah. But surely he'd put the. We've already got I ad. <laughs> it's actually just encouraging people to run ads on Twitch. That's the whole thing. I'd. Yeah, we've already know what I is. I is the only only thing that we know for certain. You know, actually, I'm just gonna write this out on the PC because me writing it down in a book is just. Let me open a text document. Because I can't go and edit it. A B C D E F G H N J L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. Okay. 
Okay, so we know for a fact the E is our I. Hmm. I feel like that's a... Uh, that's... that can't be don't. X is definitely not D. So I'm gonna put like what it's not on an alternate. X is definitely not D. Not D. Because I don't think that makes don't. So it would make sense if maybe R was S. So we were thinking like Carl's um, someone owning something. Don't, wasn't, weren't. The I have. Mm, yeah, if R was S, it would mean that E, R would be is. But there isn't any E, R. There's E, Q. It could be Khan! It could be Khan! You know what? I reckon it's Khan. I reckon it's Khan. So R is T. I'm happy to lock that in. Because I just, I couldn't think of another word that had that apostrophe in it. So if that's... C and M is... M is A, and then N is not N. A is N. So if A is N, so we'll work it. Let, let's work. Oh, I could be won. Oh no! Imagine if it's won. Now I'm gonna work under the assumption that it's that it's X can't be C. <laughs> Ooh, oh yeah, because like yeah, it must be, but it can't be won either because there can't be a can't be a W at the end of it. It would have to be an X. X like shan't. Kaiser. You look like you've been stuck with this for ages, Lau. Hope this helps you. I am feeling burn. lonely. Thank you very much, Kaiser. Kaiser, you big sweet. Thank you. Thank you so much for using your prime on me. Thank you so much for 15 months, Kaiser. I hope you're having a lovely Wednesday. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is easy. It's no sliding puzzle. <laughs> oh, I agree that it can't be, it can't be calm. So it means that it must be won. Right? Must be, so A is still N. No, it can't be won't. Yeah, won't. Won't. It does have an apostrophe, doesn't it? So M would be won't. But then I don't think X can be W either, because like what? Like like ow? What two letter word that ends with W? Yeah, exactly, sec, exactly. And sentence is a ten out of ten. Like ow? She's alright. I think she's already had a poop. It was probably the, the reason she uh, probably barked was a poop zoomy. No, Kaiser. No, I hope you're having a nice time lurking and I hope we're uh, hope we're keeping you company. <laughs> oh, we're keeping you company while you're peeping. Borf. <sighs> what would it. Uh, shan't, can't. Let's write some down. Shan't, can't, won't, didn't. I know that's too long. Don't. Um, can't. Do you think it's going to be something really stupid? Like something that doesn't require of an apostrophe. It could be S. It could we could just like it's Tad's 
You know, tad, tads. It's tabs, isn't it? It's tads. Right? Doesn't that make sense if it's tads? Because that would make XT, and then all of a sudden that we have a we have a good like tads. Tad owns. Right, Tad from the last game. How do we feel about Tad? I feel pretty strong about Tad. I feel pretty strongly about Tad. Let's try it. Right, X would be T, A would be D, M would be A. Tad. You'll all be dead by the time she solves this. <laughs> yeah, I... <laughs> I think he's going swimmingly. Right, let's uh, let's work on the fact that that says tab the lad, right? Tads. So that would be V with something like at. It's got to be at. There's no other two-letter word. So uh, V would be A. But we've already got A. Oh, dang. Mm. Be more careful. Yeah, I think we already fucked it up. Mm. Yeah, I think it's got to be S. I think R has to be S regardless, but I don't think it's Tad's. Oh, bother, I don't have a I don't have a fortune cookie on me. I don't have a fortune cookie on me. Hang on, let me get that one. Right, we'll work under the assumption that R is S. You want to see the doggy? You see the doggy while I'm doing the fortune cookie. All right, Boba. Stale as usual. <laughs> Boba, it says you have the gift of the gab. I feel like it's another one of those backhanded fortune cookies where they secretly tell you that you talk for lunch, which I don't personally agree with. But, you know, who am I to... Yeah, she did hear the snack, I bet. You've got the gift of the gab. You be gabbing. You be gabbing, Baba. You be gabbing. <laughs> Where did my... Where did I put my... Oh, she farted and she left the room! Where did I put my blue tag? Sure. I just don't want to be sitting on it. Blue tech has been lost. The blue tech is now missing. <laughs> now what do I fiddle with? <laughs> it's my blue tech. Fine, I got a bit of white tech. Right. <laughs> Classic Suzu prank. Yeah, she just walks off and farts. And... So rude. Right. How am I? Oh, do I type it in like here? Maybe I do. I was like, I was wondering, okay, once we solve it, where do we even type it in? Uh. So we have R being S. Um. Genie, what is your final wish? Boy, I wish I were you. Genie, word but old. <laughs> I got it, I got it, Sect, I got it. That seeped through my brain. I was like, what? I don't get that. I... Sect, thank you very much. 
Badger is becoming the new and improved Enigma machine. So not even my aperture science team. Brand encryption will be able to stop her. Yeah, I'm very speedy as well, and I bred. I'm very speedy. <laughs> Thank you, Brad. I've got a feeling the M is T, just because that feels like at. Let's look for look for words with R in them. R M. That would be something starting. R can't be S. R has to be something silly. R is not S, it's E. Is it E? Because, like, it can't be S because what two letter word starts with R, that starts with R, or starts with S? Yeah, I hope I hope the fortune cookie says you will solve this puzzle any second now. It's got to be a two-letter word. So, oh shit, you're right. Shit, it is so. I'm an idiot. That means M is O. <laughs> what two-letter word starts with S? Oh my god. And Ophelia. Oh, you have charm, Ophelia. You have a charm, and others are sensible to sensitive to it. Celia, you are very charming. You're very charming. Uh, right, so that's so. Ah, uh, very charming. R S. So that means that's O. Um, another letter beginning with M. So, no. I reckon Y is N. Y is N, because no. So, no. Oh, no. Do. It could be do as well. It could be N or D. One of them's no, one of them's do. I'm gonna keep an eye on you because I've lost my blue tech and I don't want you eating it because I bet you would, wouldn't you? I've lost my blue tech. You sure you haven't eaten it? I hope you haven't eaten it. That was quite a lot of blue tech. Keep an eye on you, haven't I? Come here. Can I get a snack? Take it. You think there's a letter mistake? Peepee's on you. Even my papers on you. Hello. No doggy. Right. X must also be a, a name as well, mustn't it? Because it starts a... So a three-letter name, like Tad, but it can't be Tad because M is O, like Todd, maybe. Todd's. God's. Um... I can see. Like, I need a badge. I just know one of the letters. Just let me, let me, let me, let me tell you. Just one. Just one. Right. Could you tell me, um, you. Go on. Tell me what you is. Badge, come on. Just, just take, just take a suggestion of one of the letters. You. Give me you. You is N. You is B. Hey, Haley. 
So U is N, okay. So U is N, that means Y is D. Y is D. Right. So Y being D means that What led what What? What let us what word starts with N and ends with D? Ned? Well and you Ned? Led? Nod? But we already know what O is. Not saying it is Nod. Nod. N -n Nad. Nod. Nod. I need another fucking cake. I don't want to eat two. The capital letters, they don't go on bread. What do the capital letters mean? They don't mean anything, is that what you're telling me? They don't mean anything. Why? Right. Why can't be D? I don't know what it is, can't be D. Oh, because the letters aren't grammatically correct. Y has to be W, right? Because that has to be now. N, O. It can't be Nod. Nod is stupid. It can't be Nod. Nod would be, Nod would be silly. Is it fucking Nod? Nod. That's the word, is Nod. The word is Nod. That's silly. Nod. It's not nod. No. But it's N O N O. Nod now. Because we know M is O. It's not nod. Is M not O? You can't tell me now that N is an O. M is an O. It is O. Eggnog. Nod now. Ne, ne, no, no. Uh, ne, ne, not, not. It's a T, isn't it? It's a T. Not, not. 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 Mm. Mm. Not. Right. Okay. We got. We got five letters. Great. We're doing great. We're doing great. All right. Let's have a look at words with a uh, with a Y in them, because we're looking. We're looking for a the. We're looking. There we go. The. Right, that means D is H. D is H and F is E. Okay. The. The. Yes, that has to be right. The. So if we know F is E and D is H, 
that means... Did that, really, that word really end with H? Don't question, don't question things, just... We're just here to write. That ends with T. So it could be a three letter word ending with T. So it could be fucking anything. Right. This starts H something something E. Here. Uh, here. Hero. Here. I should be really writing this out, like when we think of a letter. But blank, 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 blank. Blank, 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 blank. Blank, blank. <laughs> blank, blank, blank. E. Oh, do we know what T is? No. And then we have blank, blank, T. Blank O. So we need another word that starts, that ends with O. So we've got do, so, no. So we do need to know what D is. So D could be R. No, D is so. Never mind. No, I mean R is so. We already know that. I'm going crazy. And then we've got blank. O, as M is O, blank O, and then Y is T. Now we not. So not blank, blank, uh, blank, blank, T, blank, H. Right. And then I, uh, H, blank, blank, E, H, blank, U, N, Blank. Oh no, we know what R is, don't we? I'm on the 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 curb at the moment. The curb. S. Oh god, this is awful. Who made this? I wanna t I wanna talk to them. I wanna talk. There's a lot of H's. I'm not. I'm very uncomfortable with my choice of H now. Because there's a lot of D's. I feel like it should have been... I feel like... On the curb. Can I just... Can I ask for confirmation that H is D? Can I ask for... Can I Can I ask for confirmation of that, please? D is H. Okay. Great. Great, 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 great. So, so blank something E T. I don't know what T is yet. So that's another blank. And then H. And then double space. And then Y is T. And then O. And then W. We don't know what W is yet, but we do know that M is O. And then A is blank, and then U is blank, and then Y is T. This is like the worst hangman I've ever played. Now we have blank, blank T, H, H, uh, H blank, H blank, G blank, F. E 
And can I also get a confirmation that F is E, please? Because it's going to be really upsetting if it's not. And then we've got N. And then O. No. No. No, we don't know what T is yet. F is E. Okay, so I am, I am getting there. One letter at a time. Oh no, I had I thought I had a strike of it a you know an idea. I H blank G blank Oh, we don't need to change Hey, Aquila Star. We are, uh, we're, we're ciphering. We're ciphering. Oh. <laughs> Having a lot of fun with them. No. I should have really been putting slashes in between the words, I think, because now I'm not. Now I'm just looking at a lot of numbers and I don't know where. or a lot of letters and I don't know where the words start. I have made a very big error. <laughs> You guys, I know you guys can't see what I'm doing. I, uh, I don't think there's a way for me to show you right now. You have to trust me that it's just big brain stuff. Highly, high, big high IQ plays I'm making. And I constantly lose my place. No, okay. Cur, we don't know what. C, U, oh, we do know N. What word has an N in the middle? And then, an, uh, do we know what R is? N, S, ANS! No. INS, ENS, it mu UNS? Right, I found a word. I found cur. Hands, no, 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 it's a three letter word with N and S. Uns, ands, ends, ons. It's not a no, it's, yeah, I'm getting excited. Uns. Ins, ands. The only thing I can think of is ands. Like maybe uh, like ands bedroom, you know? It's the one of the only words that we only have one letter missing from. What would a three letter word beginning? We don't know what it begins with, but we're looking for it ends with N and S. Ends. We've already got E. So it has to be either I or U. Or A. I, U, or A. I'm pretty sure. Or a, or a, or a vowel, or a, a consonant. Be X. Not sure though. Uh. They're not, no, they're not English words.
I'm on a cur. I'm right here. I'm on cur. So I've got N and S. Oh, Rex, did you just did you just tell me the R is D? Oh, oh Rex, let something slip. R is D. <laughs> That means uh, it's C is A. Good, good. Right. Fantastic. Oopsie daisy. I'll take that as a win for me. Right. I'm not. I'm not done yet. So I'm gonna. I'm gonna just finish filling in, and then we'll fill in where I've now got. Uh, and. and uh... I, and we don't know what Q is. Hi, Q. Which I have a high. Uh, so we're here at the moment, so I'm just filling in that we need a letter for K. We've got an E, and a two letter word ending with E could be me or B. Uh, we don't have either B or M, so it could be kind of either. And then we've got. Uh, K. E blank E uh, I could be he aha uh -huh. I think K oh uh, no Hmm Hmm I was thinking it'd be here or were K could be W K could be W I reckon K is W I reckon K is, is were, and then J is, J is R, I reckon. J is R and K is W. Yes, yes. I feel very strongly about that. That means that that would be were. Were. And then that would be we. We were. And we decided that J was R, right? We were R, E. Uh, we don't know what I is. We think C is A. We've got a blank there. We've got Y as uh, T. Uh, e. And then do we have R as D? Okay. And then X, X, and then M is, what is M? I have to make my textbook a little bigger. Oh, me. Uh, X, blank, M, O, blank. See what I, now you see what I'm doing. Yeah. Right. <laughs> I was like, man, this is a bit shit just hearing me saying words. Now you can actually see such visuals. Uh, o and then Z. Don't know what that is, but we know F is E. 
So we would guess that Z is like he, uh, like an H or something. That would make sense, probably. Uh, I haven't filled in all the letters since we figured out some more as we've been going along, but um, so we are missing a couple. O and then N is U. On. We don't know what B is, but it's maybe something. John. Ah, uh, we get we'll get around to it. We'll get around to it. O Q and then we've got V and X, which we don't know what either of them are. And then O N. Again. Right. There we go. So we've got J. Now we've got well, now we've got to go back through and enter all the letters bacon i'm so invested in this puzzle now the answer has better be good <laughs> honestly i same bacon the same i am so invested i've lost my i've lost my blue tack i've i've lost i've lost everything to this puzzle i've lost everything i still don't know where that blue tack went i put it down to get the get the I still don't know where it's gone. Not in my pouch. I've lost everything. I've got nothing left except this puzzle. <laughs> Thank you so much for 17 months. Thank you very, very much. I hope it, um, I hope the puzzle coming to a close or, uh, you know, us getting the answer for it is, uh... Oh, read. It's like a nice celebration. Read something something. Don't know what any of those are. So not. Good. Yeah, I think the O and the N will be fairly easy. The two words down here will be really easy to fill in. I just want to go back and make sure that I'm keeping on top of all of the things kind of up here that we've got to fill in. Uh. R M U M Y A K, which we have W. Wah. Wah. Watch. Watch. Oh my god, it's watch. T is C. Watch. Watch, it's watch. T is C. T is C. So that takes us back up to here and we get the T. Right? Here's watch. Uh, and then we've got H. A. We've got H. A. Hey, Vargas, how you doing? Oh my god, my dad paid £70 in 1993 money for seventh guest. Hooey! Oh my gosh. I think you should play a lot of power. It's, it's, it's a great game. It's really great. The S is in the wrong spot, is it, on the third row? Yeah. Ah, we'll get, we'll get, we'll get to it. We'll get to it. I'll let, I'll double check myself. Uh, D... Uh, a G. We don't know what G is yet, but we'll get we'll get to it. Um, it's probably like hate or something, or have. It's it's have. I can't leave that on. So T is. Huh? G is B. G is V. We got any G's that we're missing? No. Okay. I have. K I have D curb. Yeah, D curb. I have hands. <laughs> I have hands. D curb. Is it here that the S is in? But D U. D curve D curve. 
り。I have hands. What's the last D curb? Oh, we don't even have an S yet. We don't even have an S. No, I don't, I don't leave until this puzzle is gone. I have hands? I guess, I guess the, I guess B is S. I, because I have hands is the only thing that weirdly makes sense, right? D curb. I have hands. Great. Key. So K. W. Or maybe it's with. Yeah, I bet it is. With. With. I have hands with. Um. I have hands with which, with with which to. With with which to with which to O A, A W, W M, A. U, got you. I have hands with which to which to something. I have hands with which to. <laughs> Which to something, uh, Z, N, D, C, uh, G is D, have no, have no, have no crotch, is that the word? That's not the. I have no crotch. Perhaps eleventh hour is best hour. Nah, thirteenth hour is the best hour because that's when Badger starts streaming. I have no crotch. But have no crotch. Okay, I got no crotch. All right, fine. Fair enough. Fair, fair enough. I have have ooh, yeah. have no. I have no. I don't know what I is, but we do know what E. Haven't figured out what L is. And I run. What do you think about run? Ran? Run? Thinking A is you. And I run. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So that would fill in that. Have we got any other A's to fill in? Oh, we've got Zay. Yeah, because that'll be B. B, B Z will be B, right? B. That's a B. But, uh, so we've got either of the Zs. Uh, yeah, we've got but, no crotch. That's why we've got no crotch. Right. Put this one up? I think I'll put this. What I think was S. Ah, yeah. But have no crotch. That looks like it's gonna say retreated, but I'm not not convinced that's what it says. I oh, we haven't figured out 
is A, Y is T. I got too many. J, F, I, C, Y. Related! Oh my god, is this gonna be incested? We were related! Okay, alright, alright! Okay! So, I is L. Related. You got any R? Okay. I'm getting incesty now! Mm hmm. I reckon that I have no legs. It's gonna be legs. I have no legs. Oh, but, uh, what? God, what? Things legs. B. No. I have no legs. Yeah, it's L is G. We got any other G's? I think we did. Oh, sorry, any other L's? Nope. Okay. But have no crotch, I have no legs, and I run. If. I feel like that must be if we were related. Maybe. Like Q. I don't, I don't know, it just. It really sings to me. It sings if we were related. If we were related. So Q is F. We got what A is. Uh if we would if we would related, you'd X is U. X is Y, sorry. You'd You'd B. You'd be <laughs> if we were related, you'd be son, you'd be son. Yeah. You'd be son of You'd be son of. I figured out what V is. Yeah, no, yeah. Son of my. V is W. Uh, v is M. Sorry. You'd be son of my. Read Read my Read my Fate Read my fate but not so watch I have hands with which to I have hands with which to wank. I have hands with which to count. Ah, uh, is that the error? Is that the error? Because I have hands with which to count. Read my fate, but not so watch. I have hands with which to count, but have no crotch. <laughs> what the fuck is up with this? No crotch! Like, it comes out of fucking left field, absolutely out of nowhere, all of a sudden he's announcing that he's got no crotch. But have no crotch. I have no legs, and I run. If we were related, you'd be son of my son. I feel like our biggest issue is the fact that we don't have a fucking crotch at this point. Items don't usually have crotches. Am I supposed to type this in, or am I supposed to be finding something? That doesn't have a crotch.
No crotch yet has sun. So maybe a sunflower? The Bobber no, the Bobber no. Oh, I missed it. I missed it. I can't cheat now. Read my fate, but not so watch. I have hands with which to count, but have no crotch. <laughs> Fuck sake, crotch. I have no legs and yet I run. I have no legs yet I run like a like a fridge. Like either a refrigerator running. If we were related, you'd be son of my son, so I'd be his granddad. Um. Ooh, bad. Move. Quit focusing on the crotch. I just can't figure out what, like, like, <laughs> like what crotchless granddad am I am I looking for? Uh, if you do follow age, Bobber, you get similar to what you're looking at. What are you looking for? Okay, what, what granddad doesn't have a crotch, you know? Do you not have a crotch? Sir! Sir, are you a grandfather? He doesn't have a crotch, he's a bust. Read my face. Maybe he's a grandfather. No, okay. Maybe Stauff is a grandfather and he doesn't have- Like, he was a bust, right? That was That was clever. He doesn't have any hands though. Yes, yeah. Where he very clearly does have hands here. That sunflower. Is dumbfounded the only expression you have? Read my fate, but not so watch. I have hands with which to count, but I have no crotch. I have no legs, and I run. If we were related, you'd be son of my son. I feel silly. I I I got it, guys. I got it. I got. I I feel. S I would argue that this clock has a crotch. I would argue because it's got two little feet here. It's got two little. I would argue that this is the clock's crotch. I would. I. Okay, now. Yeah, it has legs. Something's. Happened to Samantha. <laughs> I would argue that Something's clock has a crotch. Who's Samantha? Can you help her? Oh, sorry. She... I don't know. I have to get out of here. I'm scared. Wait. Where's Robin? I just need to make you sure the most important thing is on the screen. Up, up, up. Where's, where's, where's Robin? They haven't even told us the names of the characters. Like, oh, you've. Aloy Gijet Ik. Okay. I have one question. I have a one question. Is this the same cipher? Or is this a different cipher? It looks like it's a different cipher, if I'm honest. Back for more? Test it out. Alright, let's test it out before we before we save and say fuck future badger, right? Let's test it out. I'd assume it was a different cipher, so would I. I would think it would too. Uh, yeah, no, it's a, it's a different cipher. Well, fuck future badger, eh? Hey. Eh? The job for that's a job for badger. 
next Wednesday. I don't, I just don't understand why it was necessary to say that the grandfather clock had no crotch. I just, I, I feel, I feel like that was entirely unnecessary and rude for the grandfather clock, if anything. <laughs> this is a crotchless cipher. Talking about crotches though, I really need to pee. <laughs> okay. Read my face, but do not watch. Read my fate. Oh, read my face, but do not watch. Oh, God. I thought it was fate. No, you're right. See, that would have made it a lot easier. I wouldn't have gone around looking for a man with no crotch that might or may or may not be a grandfather, you know? It has legs. It has legs. So in between the legs are the clock crotch, right? You, you'd like your clock to have a strong crotch or else it will fall over. No, no, thank you very much for sticking with me. Even when you couldn't see me typing the cipher in, um, I'm glad that I did. Uh, I'm glad that I was a, a, a big, brave streamer and tried to figure out how to put it on stream. You wanted to look around for the clotless moment. <laughs> I was sitting there being like, was there like a painting with like some fruit in front of the crotch to like, you know, so the crotchless? Don't forget, guys, we'll be back tomorrow. Back tomorrow, we're having a, uh, not a surprise, but we're having a, a rare Thursday stream because I've got a doctor's appointment on Friday, really awkwardly positioned. So we will be, um, we'll be streaming tomorrow. It will be Resident Evil Village and probably the, f the finale of Resident Evil um, in terms of uh, before the DLC. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, that'll be fun. Oh, I will actually, Chad. You know what? Good one, Chad. Good one. Hey, Cadridge! Cadridge, you came in right at the end. No! Th Thank you very much for hanging out despite the despite the difficult puzzles or um for as well as the difficult puzzles. And we will uh we will do a bit of a raid. We will raid Aura Visage. I don't want to get, I don't want to be like, I don't want to get, get her name wrong the first time I visit. I don't want to get it wrong. Um, she is a streamer that you guys suggested and I checked out. And she seems really lovely. She seems really lovely. Auroral Visage. There you go. Seems really lovely. The, the, I went in there and she was starting to talk about anime and I was like, I'll be back. I'll be back. Congratulations to the master cryptographer, Captain Badger Tail CPT Rooks. salute. Brooks, thank you so much! The master crypt cryptographer. <laughs> I'm gonna start it. I'm gonna write that on my CV. Like I'm gonna give my CV to anyone. The Enigma Machine. No, guys, you have a wonderful day. Have a lovely rest of for Wednesday. For Wednesday? Crotchtographer. I won't write that on my CV. <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow at 1 p.m. for the finale of Resident Evil Village, but also we might end up doing the DLC on Monday, but you wanna catch me tomorrow. Catch me, catch me outside. Guys, have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. <laughs> I'll, see you. I'll see you soon, enjoy the raid. And everybody who's watching the VOD, I hope you're having a nice time. I hope you I hope you enjoyed all of the spooky spooky puzzles and I will see you in the next stream as well. Bye.